Hello, hello. Oh my god, I have the, the, there is just really funny conversations going on, so I have to, I have to, I have to, uh, I have to, um, first, I have to send karate all the shenanigans going on in my house right now because it's a, it's a madhouse. It's a madhouse. Also, was it the right one? Am I stupid? I am stupid. Okay, give me a second. How is everybody doing? Hello, my house is a mess. <laughs> Hi. Hello, hello, hello. Coolio, I don't deserve you. Thank you so much for all the freaking so many months of subs. I genuinely don't deserve you. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> So, so Nerva and I were, were screeching at each other before stream and I felt like uh, I needed to go live so that I could I could tell you what we're talking about. Vern, hello. Coolio, hello. Monkey, hello. Shadow, hello. How is everybody doing? Has officially broken down. No! What? What happened? Lola, hello. It's like, oh, Diana, hello. Hello, Angel. Hello, hello, Lola, hello. How is everybody doing? Oh my god. Connor, hello. Bruh, I'm just stuck in my house. I am a mess. No! You have flooding yet? Dude, that's so scary. I took my dog for a walk to see all the neighbors in the home and bored and just sitting outside watching the storm together this afternoon. Oh, I hope it's okay. Is your power still on? You deserve some. Oh, you guys are so cute. Okay, first off, so today I had the migraine from Mofo Hell, okay? I had the migraine from hell. And so then uh, the then also also um yo yeah you guys can't see me like this. Hold on. Yeah. This works out. Okay, okay, check. Check what's in my room right now. That's not a very good angle of it and it's sideways. You cannot tell what it is, I realize. Yo. I got a full size fucking fridge in my in my stream room. <laughs> Where's the reflection of me? I'm trying to see. You guys can see. Oh, hello, hello. Do you see my hands? It is I. Oh, you know what? I realized you're seeing the reflection of Nerva's lap uh, computer. Not mine. I'm doxing Nerva. I was like, I thought it would be, I would be in the reflection. So that's why I was like, why can't I see me? Anyway. <laughs> anyway, anyway, let's put that back to the linker poo area. Also, also up the, uh, linker poo had a cupcake. The bowl is flipped over, like over there, over there somewhere. And, and I'm sure there's there's frosting all over my fucking carpet and it's just gonna be something I'm dealing with later because I don't feel like dealing with it second. <laughs> number two, number two. So then we have a mini fridge down here, okay? We have a mini fridge down here. So my parents are like, okay, so this, I'm a story time, story time. My parents are like, oh, the background doesn't work in that. Okay, that doesn't matter. Okay, so, so my parents are like, 
so we're getting you a fridge. Which fridge do you want? And I'm like, this is yesterday. I'm like, what? What? And they're like, what? What? What fridge you want? What fridge you want? So you see, there's like this one, and then this one, and but this one is like on sale and is from the scratch and dent. And I remember when we remodeled the house in Washington and you really like the ones with the like the glass door so like this one's a floor model and it has a little dent in it but like and it's a bit more but like I thought you would like it more so do you want this fridge or the other fridge and I was just like what this is like me like after I just woke up and I let Link poop and I'm like For my, my mom's like yeah we just decided like we should finish more of like your stream room and like we might as well put like like a little like bar down there so we're just gonna put a fridge down there plus like your mini fridge sucks so we'll just give you a fridge and i'm like and she's like showing me pictures of fridges and she's like which one you want and i'm like she's like you want you want you want the nice one and i'm like And then my dad comes over and he's like, he's like, he like comes over and, and he's like. Guess what? And I was like, I was like, what? And he's like, it can make square or round ice cubes. And I was like. You know what? You know, <laughs> I guess we're getting the round ice cube fridge. <laughs> I think they wanted, and I, it's because I was like, I was like, well, we plan on selling the house though, so like, it, I can't, like, I, it doesn't matter. Just choose whatever you want, like. Like, I, we're not gonna live here much longer. So, like, hopefully, like, and my mom's like, well, it might take a year or two to get rid of the fridge and stuff, or not the fridge, the house and everything, so you can use it. And you know, like, you can always take the appliances when you move out. And I'm just like, so I have a full size fridge. I have a, I have a full, I, the water is not hooked up to it yet for the water dispenser but now i don't have to go up and down the stairs to get water and then i had a portable water dispenser but the problem is is it's like to to hoist for me to hoist the water onto the like glug glug even though it's a smaller one it only does like three of my yetis and then it's too heavy for me to hoist it and can trigger my pot so i can't so i'm like so anyway anyway my parent and then okay okay what's we so anyway I have the mini fridge and Nerva's like, okay, so once we get the fridge up and running, I'm just going to move the fridge, the mini fridge out into the, into the, the garage. And I was like, why we could put it in your or my room. And Nerva's like, what are you going to put in that fridge? And I was like, He's like, are you gonna, you cannot have a soda fridge in your room. That, that, that's not, that's the, you can walk 10 feet out and get, that's, you're gonna be drinking soda in your bed at 3 a.m. And I'm like, but what if I want sparkling water in it? And he's like, what, you want me to bring your soda stream up there? And like, I'm like, no, but it could like pre toot all of my sodas and then I can have spark. When are you going to drink the sparkling water? You're going to be like hopped up on, on Coca-Cola and Pepsi in the middle of the night and first thing in the morning. <laughs> you just on my no, but what if I when you put my snacks in there? So then I, I can't, when they go out in the middle of the night to get snacks, I don't make all the dogs go. <laughs> Me 
He's like, you don't need a fridge in your room. You don't. Your room is like 10 feet from the fridge in the in the kitchen. You literally live off the kitchen. You're just gonna keep soda in there. Maybe I want, maybe I want snacks in there. You don't need it. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we were arguing over uh, right before stream, and I just figured, I just figured I would tell you. <laughs> Yo, I like my meat and cheese, baby. Okay, okay. <laughs> Is the fridge full of pickles? But yeah, anyway, that that's the story. That's the story. Anyway. <laughs> Hi, Asuna. I'm glad you find him in the location that isn't badly affected. Well, that's good. That's so scary. Nerva multitasking of hurricane migraine, though. Oh, I can't imagine. I feel like shit today and I'm nowhere near it. Oh, double stashed on a Wednesday. So did everyone else get any prime day? Oh, shit. Is today the last day of prime? I didn't even look. Does it end at like midnight or do I get like in the early mornings and I can do it after stream? My face would be like that too. <laughs> the real question is the fridge full of, I think they wanted a nice fridge with the, with the old fridge, with the old fridge. <laughs> no, so yeah, I got the little, I got the little, little mini fridge, but it, and then they brought like cabinets and a sink down. So uh, we just have to hook up the water. I'm most excited about the water dispenser. I'm not going to lie. But yeah, <laughs> convenience of it. I'm sorry, Nerva, but I agree with Mizu. The fridge in the bedroom is great. Yes! Get burn! Jerry, you're my number one. <laughs> Nerva's right. I bought a 12 pack of my favorite drink. It's been sitting in my room. I keep drinking them without leaving my room. I just grab it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the cold snacks get soda snacks for the bed. I actually getting one under my desk soon. My fridge is even five feet <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. My mini fridge could fit next to my feet. I'm not going to lie. Also, I'll update on the spider. My mom fucking found it and murdered it. And no, none of us are assuming it was a different. We are all assuming there is only one spider in the house and she killed it. And we're not going to question it or think otherwise. All right. The spider is dead she explained it she said how big it was she was like she's like she said how big it was and like and i was like bro that's exactly it. and it was like <laughs> on my fucking finger last night so yeah we're gonna assume we're gonna assume it's dead i shook my blanket out extra good and i didn't find it so yeah do it lol me do i stream to talk about mini fridge in my room or on stream <laughs> All you need is a toilet chair and then you're moving out to the dude. I know, I know. And my chair reclines. It can do the like, can it do this like meme? So like also. So wait, the spider story? I felt oh shit. You gotta chat. You just gotta the, dude, dude, you just uh, me playing Genshin after the scary game, and then I, I'm a little cold. So I, I pull I pull my little my little blankies up and then I'm like smoothing the blankies down on top of me and i feel this thing it feels kind of like a noodle and i think oh man did i get food on my blanket so i start wiping down trying to find where the thing was only for <laughs> something crawling up my motherfucking finger and i look down and it's like a freaking spider like this like like this big I know it's not that big, but that's big for Montana, okay? And I scream, and I chuck my fucking blanket to the floor. Now I realize the spider is under my blanket, so I start stamping on the blanket. Nerva looks over, thinking I'm playing the hair as a scary like game, only to realize I'm playing fucking Genshin. And I was like, he's like a bug on you, and I was like a huge spider, and I was too scared to look under the blanket. And then I I ended the stream and went to bed. Okay, it was traumatizing. <laughs> also, also, I I feel like I feel like uh, you guys need to witness this. 
because I think it's really funny. So Linkerpoo didn't eat all of his cupcakes, so we brought it down here, and I just figure feel like you you guys should should see what the fuck he was doing. It's a look <coughs> right before stream. <coughs> I really want to yell at him because there's frosting on my carpet, but it's just... <laughs> he did it on fucking purpose, I swear! It's really hard to be mad at him when he's enjoying it so much. <laughs> he, he says, I'm saving it for <laughs> later. It over. If only it crawled in you were in playing, I would have noped out of there. I don't know if it would have been worse or better, but that, yeah, dude. Also, also, um, I was sending cruddy pics, so, but here you guys can witness. My room is messy. No one is judging it, okay? Everything is, like, all moved around. Th this is the glass door on my fridge. <laughs> Karate's like, I didn't even know fridges like that exist. <laughs> Anyway, hi. We're gonna play scary games, but yeah, dude. Oh my god. So yeah, that's the stories of uh uh. So uh, here's the here's the 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 quick you know flashcards of of what happened today. Number one, mofo migraine. Y'all better like backseat me up the butt, okay? Number two, uh, I have a ginormous fridge in my stream room now. So that's cool. Number three, almost died to a spider, but my mom murdered it yesterday or the, today when they were doing all that. So uh, number four, there's squished cupcake on my floor, and that's a that's that's a that's gonna be a uh, a, uh, a a a problem for not today. That's. <laughs> <laughs> you guys got the spark notes, okay? There you go. <laughs> oh my god. So much translation happens. <laughs> ah, so anyway, hi! I hope you guys are all staying safe during the... Dude, it's so fucking scary. And you guys just had one, too. I Please be stay. I didn't bring water down here. I just have coffee. I guess caffeine is my, my hydration today. Um, please be staying safe. That shit scares me. I God, I hope everybody's staying safe. It's crazy i feel like uh, apparently my mom was telling me you guys don't usually get them from like the gulf of mexico or whatever like they don't usually come from that direction and everything so like it's like even in parts that like don't get hit by tropical storm dude it's so scary i'm so sorry and sending my love and prayers and and thoughts to everyone uh please be safe um <clears throat> oh okay wait 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 uh, yay, I love when we start with the, the glitchy anomaly, and thank you. It has something to do with power surge. That's 100% what it is. Maybe I need a different cable. It probably won't matter, though. Probably cost. I think I tried. Uh, you know what's weird, Nerva? Every time I have to replug, um, in my, um, my capture card, now it crashes v specifically VC face. So the error is happening in combination with VC face. Which makes no fucking sense. It must be a graphic thing, right? Like, didn't- what was wrong with your VC- remember your VC face was fucked up and then we figured out it was some obscure weird thing? We should have wrote it down because now it's messed up again. <laughs> But anyway, um, it, it definitely has something to do with VC face, so that's fun. Which would explain why it didn't happen when I wasn't streaming. Because I didn't test it with VC face. VC face has a, has issues. It's great, but god damn. Okay, uh, what was okay, I remember in boot camp there was a big brown recluse in our tent. Oh my god, I walked so I watched someone leap two cots and scream. I walked over with my boot, stomped it, and then when I picked up my foot, it took off. I literally got chills. Then walked back up and stomped it again, then slid my foot back until I saw its gut scary spider dude, dude, no those motherfuckers are genuinely such assholes. We, okay, we used to, 
we used to get them in Washington. I don't know which, okay, I'm, happened again. I don't know what the difference is between the recluse and the, and the, and the, and the hobo. Don't, I don't want to know. I'm not, I cannot be bothered to Google. I don't care. Either way, those are the two ones we'd have. And during mating season, they're so fucking aggressive. And, like, they'll, like, run at you. You'll see one on the floor, and you'll be like, oh, shit. And they'll come sprinting at you. I dropped one time. One was trying to get Linker Pooh's butt and trying to crawl at him. And I was like, I was like, oh, shit. So, like, I ran to go get I the nearest thing next to me. I grab a shoe box that has shoes in it. I drop it on it. I pick it up only for it to, like, stand up and be like... <laughs> Dude, those guys, they they are literally aggressive. They will attack you. They are not nice. I didn't know we had them here. It, and, and now I see them all the time here. And I swear to God, when I moved back from Washington, I brought them in boxes or something. Like, ugh. We had a really cold winter last winter, too. So I was hoping they would all be fucking dead. And they're not. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much for the su Oh, shark. Oh, thank you. I thought you were testing, and I was like, I forgot to put the horror alerts on. I'm sorry. <laughs> thank you, Nerva. I don't deserve you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Um, But hi, Night River. Hello, hello. Told my mom I, I got my PC, and she said she could have told uh that you should have told me you were going to do that. We could have gotten a payment plan so you don't have to spend all money at all. You could cancel it if you want and do that, but it's okay. That's so sweet. Oh, I was just thinking about this, and I meant to tell you this last night and during the scaries, and I forgot. Um, You were saying how you felt, like, sick and were so nervous after you made your purchase, and I just wanted to... I, it just dawned on me today. I was thinking about you buying your PC, and I was like, oh, my God. It just really reminded me of... Uh, so uh, when I was uh, streaming... Uh, when I first started streaming, I started streaming on a laptop that was like duct taped the hinge together so it wouldn't fall apart and I never closed or opened it. And that's how I, I, I streamed. And I, after a couple months of streaming, was able to have enough money to buy a um, a PC. And I, my budget was like 1200 And uh, that was the by far... The most money I had ever spent besides um, when I bought my mattress, which I had a st I used my student loan to buy my mattress, too. So it was a little different. And I just remember like like buying all the parts and just being like sick to my stomach. And then we had an issue uh, building it and being so fucking nervous because it was like the biggest purchase I had ever fucking made in my life. And I just was thinking about that and really relating to it. Uh, I had a, a, a pawn. Um, Upon uh, delivery, I had a bad RAM stick, and I re I just remember being like so crushed because I didn't know what was wrong, and I spent all my money, and it was not working, and I was so fucking scared and 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 stuff. But it all worked out, and it was like, but I was just really reminiscing about that. I mean, that's kind of I I just bought my laser on a payment plan. And I still was like, oh, after I bought it. <laughs> I remember playing Silent Hill games with a buddy, and I never play one again. <laughs> yeah, this is a remake of number two. Um, normally the Gulf storms hit Louisiana or Texas, and the last storm the armpit of uh, of Florida. But like this all day, the local news were just watching tornadoes. At That's insane. Do you guys usually get tornadoes on the southeast side of the storm? that has been creating lots of tornadoes, and there are damages coming from the storm. Oh, God, it's so scary. Please all be safe. Oh, yeah. Did the program break? I didn't even think about that. You're right. What? What was that? <laughs> did you guys see the little... Wait. Did you guys see the little poof? <laughs> sorry, but look at the glitch. Oh, shit. Sorry. It farts. It farts when I restart the program. He's not paying attention. He's playing Melee. All right. Scare alerts are on... Um, scare alerts on, on, let me change my title really quick. I forgot about that. Oh, let's do the ad really quick. Uh, the ad's about to play, um, and then we'll start. Da -da. 
but yeah but yeah uh reminded reminded me of that i was reminiscing but that's really cute i'm glad your mom is so supportive dude you should have told her you're so cute curse the ads but if it helps uh, you so fine <laughs> thank you thank you for watching them i mean you're subbed you won't get them um but we'll we'll wait we'll wait oh let me restart actually let me get into game and double check the audio is i think it's yeah we're having the error it seems like the power surge from the console is because it's the power like is what causes the flicker and for some it doesn't make sense it would be a graphical thing with No, that's just the water dripping, okay. It's weird it crashes my VC face. It's very odd. Makes no sense. That's definitely a new issue. You know what? Technology do be weird in sometimes. Who are we to question it? All right, the ad is playing. There we go. Okay, anyway. Weird, weird, weird. Um, okay, well, it's weird because, uh, but yeah, how accurate the trend. <laughs> um, but anyway, hi, is a laptop in a glass case? Yeah, display case specifically. I mean, we still have it. I didn't get rid of it, but no, <laughs> that'd be funny though. What type of PC build do you lean more towards? Intel or AMD CPU and NVIDIA or GPU? Okay, you know, you know, it's funny because I was thinking about this because I was, I was looking at the PCs that, um, the the like um the 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 monkey was building because i just overall slowly upgrade i don't like rebuild a brand new pc every time i add a new part um when i built my pc five years ago i i have um i have an amd cpu and i have an nvidia graphics card so when it comes to like intel processors or amd gpus i am completely in the dark but it's so funny because i'm pretty sure the meta is the opposite right now is intel plus like amd gpu but it's so funny because it's like i didn't match amd cpu with gpu um but yeah Fun fact, I also smashed a, I dropped my, uh, uh, one of our, well, Nerva pulled uh, one of our CPUs out and it had a bent pin. So I don't know if it always had a bent pin. I fixed it. Then I accidentally dropped it on my desk and then had more bent pins, fixed it, and then put it in my second PC and it, it, it still works. So not going to question it. This game is so scary. Always, so Dude, I get a heart attack. Oh, shoot. Speaking of which, I need to put my heart monitor on. See, this is a good reason. We're just chilling while the ad's playing. It works out. Hi, Doomslayer. How are you doing? It is no joke. Category 3 is tied down cat 2 and below or chill from my experience. Dude, I literally... I don't understand how people live in places that those things happen. That is just terrifying. And then the damage it does. And like having to deal with that i just literally can't imagine having to like on the regular deal with that every oh scary 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 you guys are, are troopers nerva used to live where someone was somewhere like in oklahoma and there was always fucking tornadoes and they would just whiz by and it's like well it's good at mr house and it's just like what oh my god that is just like so fucking scary man I don't know how y'all do it. I don't know how y'all deal with that shit. That is like weird, crazy, scary. They have a countdown timer, five hours remaining on prime day. No! <laughs> Aww. Dude, the ad just ended. And the audio anomaly just started again. Son of a bitch! Scottish Les, hi! How have you been? Hello! Sorry. 
I'm just not dealing with my hand tracking today. You guys don't get hand tracking for now because I have to reset it every time I have to reset PC face. As well, because it'll be backwards. All right, all right. Let's pray it, it stays. There we go. It can be weird. <laughs> if it gets too scary, I must. No, that's okay. Uh, all right. Thank you guys for watching the ad. It supports the channel a ton. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um. Okay. Uh, tech community I'm hearing currently, and I'm focused on mid-range uh, build while Nvidia is fucking on higher end stuff. I feel like uh, I I mean I don't know when I was like looking at GP or CPUs the other night, it looks like Intel has a ton of stuff that competes with like thread rippers and stuff. So it just depends. But yeah, thank you for the lurk. I'm glad you're doing good and stuff. Thank you. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I hate this game, but you know. <laughs> They, same thing as Texas not knowing how to deal with snow, but it's not... Dude, okay, snow doesn't fucking ruin things, okay? Compare, like, unless you're out here driving, like, a, like, like a fucking turd and running into shit, okay? Like, I guess it does ruin stuff if stuff freezes, okay? But, but, like, most places go below freezing at some point. I, I genuinely, I genuinely feel like like a tornado and or like a tsunami or or a hurricane is it or like really really bad earthquakes but but you can earthquake proof stuff like i i feel like tsunami tornado those things you're just fucked shit falls down goes boom boom everything's destroyed water log everything like dude i don't know man it's like people you can't freaking Hurricane proof your house. The water comes in, it just comes in. But yeah, can you translate or translate hood and back? Probably not. It's Google Translate is what it runs through. Things that she secretly loves it. I still fe fear the chonkla most of the time. <laughs> We live in Montana, you have a volcano, so you have fire and earthquakes, possibly. Bruh, that thing is fine. Everybody says it's overdue, but at the same time, they're freaking whatever. What's the word? What's the, what's the, dude, it, Hawaii is way scarier. They have a fucking active volcano. What do you mean? Also, in Washington, to be fair, I used to live, uh, and we had the Lahar drills, and it goes, Wah! and pretty much we would always do these drills where you had to like uh, uh evacuate the school but i don't i i genuinely i'm gonna be real with you guys Th they're stupid they're stupid because if mount saint helens ever were to even just like have a little baby burp or fart all of the all of the the snow pack on the mountain would melt into muddy sludge and and just devour it like like the whole entire like valley like pompeii and i will tell you that like you need to do it in like they they practice it every year and to actually successfully evacuate you would need to do it in like 10 minutes or like 20 minutes or something and it takes them like two hours so it's like it's useless there's no reason why they even do it there's the, the amount of time it would take to get everybody out of the area you can't in the, in the traffic jam everyone's fucking dead if the law horror ever have anyway sorry <laughs> i used to live there although i lived above the the um the sludge zone but if i if you're Also, warning, there are scare alerts on, I believe. We have sound alerts down below, uh, and yeah. You should answer the door. Monkey, have you seen a playthrough of this? Because I swear to fucking God. You better backseat me, you little, little turd. I'm sorry, I wasn't going to call you a bitch, but then I realized we might not be friends like that, and that would be too mean. <laughs> I feel like I feel like there's some people that I can like josh around. I can really I, I I can really like I can really joke around with, but then I like you know you know what I mean? But I feel like also there's like some of you that would be a little too mean. That would be a little too mean. I don't want to be mean to my view. I can I can I, I can be mean. I can be mean to like my my friends like and like people that we like have that kind of relationship with, but I also feel like 
Like, I don't know how close we are, you know, that I can bully you. <laughs> I, I, I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings, okay? I'll... <laughs> Lola's like, ah! <laughs> Also, I'm not in the death zone of... I'm on the edge of the death zone of of the volcano. I pretty much It's fine. That looks like dude, this person's sad they don't got cake. Nerve damage, nerve, nerve damage. What in the farts? That is not cool. Y'all see that shit? That was not me. Hmm. Good thing I killed that thing before I came in here. I'm assuming, dude, my light wouldn't work. How it goes the game? We only just started because we were farting around and I was regaling you of the tales of my youth, but you know, um... <laughs> why does scary games like bring... Have you guys noticed that when I play scary games, I get a little bit snarkier? I don't know where, where the, my, like... I don't know. <laughs> Out the dominoes in Balta along with booze playing music and make peace with the holy spaghetti monster in the sky! <laughs> Looked up and I, uh, I love those kind of jokes. Yeah, Mizu has no problem bullying me. Hey, I feel like if I made that joke, but then I would have to like double back and be like, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm sorry. Like, head pats. She bullies you. Do you need a lawyer to help? Blink twice. <laughs> Did you just shoot him in the ass? Bro, that's their weak spot. The butthole. <laughs> no, I just can't sleep. <laughs> my anxiety brings out the worst of my humor. God. Um, the worst thing about this hurricane for me was the fact that a 95% heal. Oh, dear Lord. That is the worst part. Oh, dude. I, I, I put on a clean shirt earlier and like triple layered my deodorant only to like do something for like 20 minutes, like not even work out or anything. And then realize I needed deodorant again earlier. And I was, I was just, I was just. I, I was just upset with myself. I blame the migraine, okay? Also, I'm gonna I'm be honest with you. I am running on the mo the migraine of, 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 of centuries, okay? I would say it's at like 75% level. Is a poop uh, of what it was, but like real talk is it's not great. It's this migraine is, 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 is a douche, okay? This migraine is 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 you know is is ugh. see there it is there it is the brain fog from the freaking migraine there you go um anyway this migraine's an asshole so you guys better backseat me i don't know how long this stream is gonna be and i'm just letting you know dude my weakness the cold <laughs> bangers out of dude the last two streams i feel like the streams from until dawn a little bit and and silent hill there's been the funniest back and forth between me and chat we dude i need to like send more than just me and karate out to make clips out of it or something i i need the dude we need like an army to hit and make like these would be bangers for tiktok and and whatever that's so funny cool dude you guys you guys just get me you give me the you know we're playing a scary game but you give me the warm fuzzies inside y'all get me <laughs> Yeah, right. Nerva, did you sp spike? Uh, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. He's like, all right. Her migraine's a little crazy. We gotta, like, right, I'm put a little fireball in there. It's just cinnamon. <laughs> yeah, give me the hot flash. It felt so warm today in the ant AC because of my... Mar oh, dude, my migraines make it feel like steam's coming out of my ears. We just got to get you scared and then you have fun? I don't know about that. I think my filter... <laughs> My fear distracts my filter. 
I think that's part of it. I also, I think I feel... <laughs> oh, it just shit on me! It literally erupted out of his butthole! You're right, the colon is their weak spot! <laughs> You're joking. <laughs> no filter Mizu is great content in general. Okay, I feel like, okay, I feel like horror games, yeah, they yeet my filter a little bit because I feel like I can cuss more, you know? Some, I, I try to rein it in a little bit more. I'd be a little bit when I with the depending on the game genre. So if like it's a PG game, like like uh, like or something, I I try to rein it. In. Oh my god. Oh, that was Mises last night trying to stomp on the spider. <laughs> god just like put a clip of me like trying to murder the spider i showed my mom the clip from yesterday and she was laughing like she doesn't like scary things or cursing and she thought it was pretty funny the the, 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 the way monkey did you see the clip from yesterday nerva did you ever watch it i don't think he can hear me i think he's listening he's like jamming he's he's zooted out to uh to this clip yeah this clip have you did you did you guys if you guys didn't see yesterday this was how yesterday's stream was he's playing m competitive melee happy birthday to you happy birthday to you happy birthday <laughs> There's Monkey, never mind, he saw it, he's a drat. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you too! Why didn't you tell me you had friends over? This was a surprise party for you, not me, damn it! I don't like scary games as much either, Miss B. Came. Aw, you're so sweet. I don't like them. I don't like them. I don't like them one bit. I like watching them. I don't like playing them. But, you know. But it makes it's good for content, okay? I love watching scary games. Love them. Playing them? Not as much. Not as much. Not as much. Until Dawn is as scary as I like to get, okay? That's, that's my camp. That's my camp a camp of my my personal enjoyment where i would i would i would play it just cuz okay so act like a paparazzi and clip all the yes we have to start our jobs now act like paparazzi do all the clips it, it does help there's the new clip thing i was thinking about it okay chat hear me out i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm stalling um what item would be a good reward for like making enough content that we use for youtube we get to steal your labor <laughs> what can i what can i laser what what can i what can i laser and like give to people as like a reward like a badge or something i could like make something like a little placard i i don't know i don't know i i just thought that do you guys think that's a cute idea because i feel like most of you i'm like oh we'll do a competition or then give a, like a gift card or something like most of you don't give a shit about that stuff <laughs> right from the basement Did you get tea begged by the mon- I did. I did. The monster just makes me think of the Elden Rings. Oh, you're right. Yeah, the fingers. <laughs> Pure gold. I'm gonna go to bed. Good night, Coolio. Yeah, do you think- Do you think that would be, like, a good- Like, yeah, do you- Like, a plaque of- You know, maybe- Maybe they're numbered, and, like, every time someone hits, like, an acolyte, you get, like, a card or, like- a little item that like has your username and it has like you get like a title like 
for doing something because I feel like those are things that people would cherish more than being like here's like a $10 gift card or a $20 gift card. Thank you for your work. Like, I don't think most people really care. And obviously I don't make enough to like pay a full-time employees so or really part-time ones. So I, I feel like doing that, like a little YouTube, play, that'd be cute. I wonder if we could get like little, little tiny, do you think there's miniature play buttons so we could just laser your name on it? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> That'd be really cute. Let's see. Miniature. I spelled that wrong. Nobody judge me. YouTube play button. Yo, one. Oh. Those are really cute. Shout out to Veeb. Use my code on their website. Get yourself your own little ticker. Okay, we could totally make stuff like this. Oh, ah, 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 we could 3D print something. I do have a 3D. The Nerva has a 3D printer. Or we could do stuff like that. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. But I don't know. Maybe it, it could be something kind of cute. I don't know. Something, you know, you know. Museify it though, like your logo instead of the play button. Yeah, that'd be cute. That'd be cute. It'd be like, I don't know. Y'all are content creator simps. Help me out. Okay, chat. I, I, we need to become famous and become the biggest poopa squad in the world. All right. First, we take over 3D VTubing and then we take over the world. Okay. We need an army of poopas because our PMA needs to spread until we take over all the the and have world domination all right but i am have the body of an 80 year old in 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 uh the soul of a 26 year old or whatever and i need <laughs> i need your help making content because i suck at it and i have bullying trauma and i'm terrible at social media <laughs> and i hate listening to myself how about me <laughs> laser scared me do you, but yeah so anyway i think that would be cute do you think that would laser a twitch or a title of your name like music key support yeah we could even do like the playing card thing have one and it's just like people get them for helping i i don't know but i think those would be cute you guys like those but a plaque or something in a style would be cute maybe like a little like yeah and then there's level so like what i'm a simp oh lord i refuse now i'm starting a union D dude a simp in my definition is of like is is uh is uh, is like a word of affirmation you know but a gift card would be a great incentive for a competition but the personal made item might be more rewarding for the winner that's what i'm thinking because i feel like in general, like, when we've done them before, it's usually the same people who are participate and stuff. And just people who want to be extra helpful. I feel like most of those people already watch me a lot. And, like, having, like, a special item we made for them and that, like, is rewarded is, like, something they might prefer. Because, like, you know, you know what I mean? And I can do it more regularly. It's more, like... I think it's more nice to do that. Also, I don't know. I would want you, like, maybe a birthday gift or something, like, able to laser a piece of acrylic that I could fit into my lamp that I have then. Dude, we can do that. I can send you just uh, your own lamp. I already have the bases. They're not that expensive, bro. But we, we're still figuring it out. I have to take one day off. And I just, we did the subathon, then I was tired, and I had a doctor's appointment, and we had Linker Free's birthday. Um, I need to actually take one day off and spend a whole day zoning in my laser to figure out how to do clear things. That's what we're working on right now, because I'm failing so far. That'll open up a lot of stuff. Union is currently unavailable for music related items. Please, in the office in three years, five days, and 22 seconds. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, just an idea. If y'all have any uh, fun ideas for incentives, uh, dude, most people are like, yo, community mods, edit my shit for me, snap, snap. And then the, they're like, yeah, uh, I can already tell you guys that sucker ain't gonna flush. 
Yeah, no. She ain't gonna flush. Lost cause. Not even worth, not even worth tr attempting to flush. Anyway, um, like most people, like, I, I, but I like rewarding people and making them feel, you know what? I'm actually, wait a second. I think I'm just creating a cult. Just giving you guys like different tier list of like my love. That, that seems kind of culty. You know what? I'm into it. Whatever. <laughs> Anyway, that's just an idea. Um, I saw Rudeness's um, clip he made earlier and posted in the in the Discord and just kind of reminded me of that is all. <laughs> it's a suggestion. So yeah, if you guys have any um, any uh, oh yo, I'm also I'm also on the hunt. Yo, Jerry, I meant to DM you about this, but you're here and you're a captive audience. So, uh, how ma do you play physical card games? Why are there so many dead ones? Who's murdering them? That's like a farter right there. Um, do you, do you happen to... I missed. I wanted to shoot it because I knew that it was gonna shit over there. Why is it ticking? Um, yes, I used to get. Okay. Oh, guess you haven't seen Nervous D. Oh, are you are you talking about what I? Okay, I was just gonna ask you because. So um. We we may we finalized the design, but I, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. Like I, I'm gonna do more cards in the future, but um, I don't play like even like though I've opened Pokemon cards or whatever. I don't play these games. I don't play them, so I am completely unaware how like Magic the Gather like X Y Z one two three works, right? I don't know how to balance those things. I don't. I don't know how to like future proof it to like make a, a, a game, a card game like viable. If we choose so, like if there were ever enough cards out that we could make it, and so I, I figured I should probably get like an opinion from somebody. Oh, uh, what that would be. We could just make trading cards, of course. And, and that would be just fine to start out with. Like, this first one might just be a, a dud and, and, and not actually a playable card. But in the future, if we could actually do that, um, uh, I, I definitely would like to have just an opinion of somebody who's, who's played the card games. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Do you guys have any suggestions? Let me know. <laughs> I can't be playing Space Marine 2 and turning the Emperor to be a Mizu follower, which will only enhance her 3D VTuber. Yes! Bring me the army, Night River! Yes, good, good, good. I played Magic, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, and looking into Digi- Oh, shit, okay, okay. Well, then, you have a good rounded- You're well-rounded with your knowledge. That's perfect. I hate everything about the aesthetic that is going on here. Um, curious. Chat, for those of you guys who've played um, the original of this game, how similar? How similar is the remake uh, versus the OG? Sorry, when I stop, <gasps> I saw green numbers. I saw green numbers. Chat, did you see that? I saw green numbers on my heart monitor. That never happens ever, 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 ever. I I have it custom set, by the way. Um, for where uh, for me, what is uncommon heart rates? That's amazing. Sorry, I'm I'm really I'm really proud of myself. When I stop talking and go silent, it's because I'm listening, if that's not apparent. Hmm. 
Is this supposed to be vibrating in here? I think that was just ambient noise, but I, I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. <laughs> It's different because uh, because it was pretty much Resident Evil 1 with fixed camera. Oh, okay. So it's very, very, very different. Interesting. So, like, you wouldn't be able to walk me around the, the building or something like that. Yeah, we can talk about... Okay, okay. I was wanting to play D&D, &D, but it's hard to find people to play with. Uh, there's a lot of people in the community who play, but, again, you'd have to play online. It's a horror game, and the first complaint is the aesthetic. Are you a decor specialist? Yeah, I don't like the aesthetic, bro. I like I like decor. The remake is the first one that is Resident Evil like. Oh, really? This remake is interesting. Okay, it was a virus. It sounds like. <laughs> okay. Actually, don't know why. Um, we're getting that sound. so odd everything's dead in here i think it's just ambient i don't know okay there must be something through the wall this is picking it up like something's alive nearby god it's so dark it gets really hard i can't imagine playing this game without the lights without the lights off in your room, you would not be able to see anything. And even still, I feel like my monitors like are too bright. I don't really want to go in there. I feel like all of these will come back to life. That's great. Um. Okay. Give me one second. Also, I have, like I said, my migraine's really bothering me today, so I'm just warning you guys. I don't know how long today's stream will be. Uh, anyway, also, thank you guys for listening to my ramblings, because I kind of... Sometimes when I'm multitasking, my brain... Do you guys do that? Like, you think best when you're doing something else, like, with your hands or whatever? I feel like that's me. And... Sometimes... Sorry, I heard something. When I'm doing mundane stuff with my stream, um... Sometimes I, I like, have little brainstorms. And I'm always thinking about fun ways to make, like, chat more involved i mean i guess that's very obvious by the kind of vtuber i have but just like fun ways to to make you guys get to be involved more and also like even though like a lot of creators like if people do like help with editing or do a lot of things for like small creators like a lot of people oh, it can feel the sound of that radio through my controller what an insane oh that's that's crazy little detail anyway I know a lot of creators probably like don't do anything they're just like thank you then maybe put you in the credits or whatever like you know whatever um but I, I try I try really hard to come up with like okay that radio is not on my line just sound is this a safe room it's just like a little too cozy in here I try to come up with like really fun ways to like make you feel like I appreciate you Hi, Origami! Hi, how are you doing? Hello! Hi, Auburn! Thank you so much for the raid! How is your stream? Hello! Hi, Albert Spoopy Raid! Hello! Welcome! Hi, Auburn! I hope you had a wonderful, 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 wonderful stream. Thank you so much for blessing us with your community. What were you up to? How was Baron Fre- Oh my god! Dude, you're coming in to, like, with the spoopy- to my spoopy stream, but, like, you're playing, like, one of the cutest games ever. That's so funny. How are you enjoying that game? Has more content came out for that game since launch? I- 
Oh, shoot. I'm having the audio anomaly. Let's fix that. Thank you so much for the raid. How was your stream? Hello, hello. I hope you had a wonderful time. Thank you so much again for the raid. Sorry, we're having some technical errors. Um, every time I restart my capture card, uh, because I get this crackling sound, um, it actually crashes my face tracking program on my computer, so I have to fix it. But yeah, uh, is it is it fun? I hope you're enjoying it. I watched. I actually I I have it and I want to play it, but I also watched someone play through it, and so I had planned to return to it when I forgot and it's definitely been long enough that I don't recall it that much <laughs> it's so cute though I love the everything about that game it's just super cute I hope you had a wonderful time you guys go give some love drop the followers thank you again uh starting to get a bit so this, is, this game's so cute oh yeah so yeah then you come in to me playing Silent Hill it's not cute there's nothing cute about this game. It, it, it's it, not even not even me. I'm not even cute during this. I keep making fart jokes because I'm nervous. <laughs> but yes, please please take care of your uh, your uh, voice and everything. You know it's uh, I saw someone uh, a thread on Twitter of people talking about it, and I thought that this was really interesting. People were talking about how like all these content creators do super long streams. Also, Ian and Malik, hello, welcome. And they were like they're like brand new content creators and and different things or people who aren't used to doing like super long streams and they were like i don't know how they do it my voice gets really sore and people are telling people how important it is to like you got to work your way up there because um like you can you can genuinely hurt your voice uh using it too long using it too much and and everything like that i'm very bl i'm a loud person i i'm a, I'm, a, I'm i'm a loud person and um so i i definitely don't run <laughs> i don't run into the issue but i've also been streaming for five and a half years and i've taken like a month break from stream before and then i come back and like my voice starts to get sore it's just one of those things like you're a lot more loud and boisterous and like in normal situations you would be you would be like taking breaks because there would be back and forth from whoever you're talking to whereas like you're just talking and reading chat and doing like it's like more one-sided um with chat like you don't have to like sit stop and listen to their audio thing and everything so yeah it's definitely it's definitely something that you gotta like work up into definitely don't hurt your voice and turn into jojo siwa i'm sorry that sounds really mean but she literally was told to not talk too much and to take a break and rest her voice and she's like nah and i'm like you're gonna ruin your vocal cords that is so bad it's very important so yeah get some tea or something i don't like tea so if you don't like tea i get it but <laughs> Dude, it, it, I hate solos, Malik, because of the sweat, but I also can't stand, like, the beginning and just being ganked by, like, three people. So I, I get it. <laughs> Ian, hello. Um, I just started playing it tonight. It's been a great game so far. And, yeah, the graphics, is, it's really cute. Yeah, no, if I'm all over the place with games, yeah, I only want for uh, an hour and a half, maybe not. Yo, if you're just not feeling it, you're just, like, you know, you got to let your voice rest. It's important. Using the diaphragm and other... Uh, it's, it's like, ugh. Yeah, I've been on streaming for four years and went on a hiatus for a few years because I went through a depression, you know? Yeah, definitely, definitely, like, take it easy and all, and don't overdo it either. But I'm glad you're, you're enjoying yourself, get back into things. But yeah, if the voice goes poop, then you do too. <laughs> Speaking of which, you know what's actually funny? Um, From screaming from this game, I actually, um, my voice is tender today from yesterday and today so it's kind of funny but you know if i haven't played horror games and screamed a lot at least to that level i'll just i do it hope your migraine is doing but it's okay it's like three quarters of what it was earlier so it's still not great but it's like way b better i feel so there's like i have like a like um but i appreciate you redbeard thank you so much uh i have a i have like a un I don't know. There's new there's new diagnosis. I need to get a new uh neurologist who specializes in odd migraines. My my migraine specialist left and I got someone from his office that did the other neuro stuff. 
and he's a placeholder. Although uh, the medicine he put me on has been helpful. Um, <laughs> but uh, but yeah, I've had constant head, head pain for more than 10 years now. And um, medicine doesn't really work. I'm intolerant to all the tryptin family. I'm kind of allergic to them or something. It gives me and like closes up my airway and gives like me nerve pain in a different way. So like belly button up for some reason, I'll get like Charlotte horse. It's really weird. Constant. Yeah. Uh, I have, a, I can count on my hands how many days in the last 10 years I've had a zero head pain day. It, it's only happened maybe like seven times, maybe less. Um, yeah, they thought I had a tumor. Cause it just kind of like worked its way up and then I like slowly was getting a lot of headaches and then at one day I realized I had not had one. I don't talk about it that much because it's kind of like the least um, debilitating part of my condition, which is so funny. It's, it's not, but it's like one of those things where like pain, constant pain is exhausting, but... Constant pain is not why I just fucking fall over or can't lift something, right? Like, do you know what I mean? But, um, but, uh, but yeah, no, 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 it, it's okay. It is what it is. Uh, we, I've been, I've tried a lot of different things. They're better than they used to be, but, um, I'm on daily, uh, migraine preventative because of like the chronic pain. And it also, uh, it's helped a lot being on blood pressure medicine. Even before I had high blood pressure and, like, the other weird stuff going on, um, there's, like, studies that show that, like, migraines can often be caused by um, blood vessels and stuff. Anyway, long story short, <laughs> um, you – so I remember having this conversation with my grandma because uh, migraines run in my family and she used to have, like – very dramatic migraines and go to the ER and get like injections and stuff before a tryptin family was like, over the counter as a pill. And she always like, is like, Oh, yours must not be that bad because you can get up and like do something or, or whatever. Like I just lay in bed and moan, like, you know, and I'm like, what, <laughs> when they're every day, when they're every day, eventually one day you decide to get up and deal with it, even though you feel like shit. I will say, though, um, so we one time te cold turkey tested me to see if I was allergic to the medicine. We were we were double checking all my meds and we hadn't taken me off of um, my nerve blocking medication. And so I cold turkey it and about 36 hours since my previous dose, I started like crying like viscerally because I thought my head was going to explode. So, so like definitely like your pain tolerance goes up as, as you, as you like, you know, have pain all the time. Right. Like I used to live my life without that. Right. And, and then, so as my medicine, like, totally kicked out and I hadn't had my medicine in a while I was like dying so it's definitely better than it used to be but some days like today I have like a motherfucker <laughs> migraine and it's just like one of the it feels like my head is getting just constantly beaten with a frying pan and like my eardrums are gonna explode um it's definitely like uh it, those days I usually stay in bed but at least today at least today <laughs> um my migraine meds kicked it down to at least enough to be able to stream you know but yeah it's it's weird it's weird it's migraines and in in head pain are still i feel like very misunderstood and confusing and they're realizing that they're created by a lot of different things and not just but yeah do i laugh but bareback and bodies kick my migraines in the ass wait 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 night shift lurker bear back and bodies what does that mean what is that is that like a drink or something i'll pray for the healing for you use the santa santa kalita de rana spell and the holy big suits <laughs> yo yo i live with tiger bomb bro i do i do i love i love that tiger bomb uh, it's constant pain because I don't uh, do I have a box ring on my bed. Uh, social assistance and the government won't give me a new one. And then I have low thyroid, depression, anxiety, and PTSD. And sometimes 
fake it. Other days, it's like, no, some days I'm in bed relaxing. And man, I got that for sure. Yeah, with all of that, I say it is what makes me, me, aw, sending hugs and love. And I hope that, um, that you feel better and, and just everything. Um, and that you can find things that, that help you out. I, I definitely feel for that. Um, dude, I will say, if you can ever get, um, if you can ever get a new mattress, that is one of the two most expensive, like best purchases I've ever made is a good chair. And also <laughs> Nogi bought me a new, uh, a new uh, secret labs chair, which I, my other one is like five years old, four years old, which isn't that old, but I sit in it for like 12 hours a day, every day. And actually it's, I go sit in my other one and it's, you can tell there's no support in it anymore. It was a great chair, but I'm like, holy shit, there's such a difference. And a mattress. I bought a really nice mattress uh, in college with my student loan, and it is one of the best purchases I've ever made in my whole entire life. It definitely is life-changing, and I have a little lift on it. Can you give me some wah? Thank y'all. And maybe a soda. <laughs> Did you consider uh, doing a, a, a vascular therapy? I, I'm not sure I know what you mean by that. What what kind of therapy? I am doing PT right now uh, for my uh, POTS. And um, I know that you can do, like, I've had this, like, there's, like, uh, supplements you can take that are supposed to strengthen your, I forget what they're called, your... Uh, your blood vessels and stuff, but uh, they don't really work for me. Um, that's why we're such good friends. We understand. I had tubes removed in my ears when I was seven, and I was in a French, um, in French immersion. They had to take me out because I I couldn't hear anything. Put cone shaped tubes in the ear and remove it. Oh, interest. I've heard of people getting tubes in their ears for like when they have um, like young kids and stuff. Um, or when they're kids and stuff and have a lot of, uh, of, uh, ear infections and everything. I've never had to have that, but it's a, it's a weird, ba oh, bear is an OTC medicine. I, I, R, C, wait, I don't know what those mean either. Tiger Balm is awesome, dude. Tiger Balm, I get the extra strength and I lather myself. I even put it on my fucking face. I don't care. My I'm my eyes just be like watering and I'm like yes burn me. <laughs> I need to go on more walks and even just uh down the street definitely. I will say like it it definitely has changed my life doing PT. I I took a little tiny break. Oh, OTC is over the counter and IRC. I remember correctly. Silly measy. What is it? Is it a pain med? Am I stupid? I <laughs> I'm sorry. There's another one for eggs called Two Old Goats. Oh my god, my secret lab's chair finally came in today and just got Oh <gasps> Yes, Red Beard! Oh my god. It's literally life changing. Buy one. Crotty, Crotty, are you in chat? Can you confirm that your your uh your uh secret labs chair is is way better than a DX racer chair? I actually do. I do uh do Epsom salt stuff. It doesn't unfortunately help that much, but I do it anyway. <laughs> I feel like it, it just adds. I And then I, in the morning, I've been doing a lot of, like, I have, like, super beats, which is supposed to be good for your cardiovascular system. And then I take uh, a super cherry pill <laughs> and, and, and vitamin D, K12, and whatever else is in it. It's about blood vessels in your brain. It's called vo vascular surgery. I got a treatment suggested one time. Interesting. If you know what it's called, post in the Discord. I'll do a little research on it. Sully, how are you doing? Do you have a bathtub? Maybe I only take baths. I actually can't stand to shower anymore. And I, I do a lot of soaks and stuff, though, which is, is nice. Oh, bears like aspirin. Oh, duh. <laughs> Sorry. Um, my, uh, my current, I've tried, uh, I'll just run through the list. I've tried maybe like eight different Tripton family drugs classes. I've tried several different antidepressant drug classes, a uh, daily pain help. The one that helps me the most is, uh, Venlafaxian, which is kind of old school now. They don't really 
or scribe that anymore but that is the only daily helper and then in combination with uh metropolol or rapamil has helped me a lot i don't know if anybody cares about that um and then um so with a bail blocker and then um my rescue medicine is butyl bitl acetaminophen caffeine and then you take it in combination uh with uh with a leaf and you can take that a couple times a day actually but you shouldn't do that because it's highly addictive yeah better than my dx racer um it, but it's real i will say it's really hard to get a butabital uh acetaminophen calf prescription because butabital is a is a uh what do you call it it's a controlled substance sometimes i get like questioned about it when i have my mother pick it up but it's funny i can get a pack of 60 of them a, uh, a month and everything and and whatever but when i was on a trip in family i got six a month i'm like bitch if i only needed to take it two three times a month i wouldn't even have a migraine prescription but yeah um i got the rathalis special edition one for the collab and they were doing the monster hunter and they pushed it back a few times so i just had to wait really 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 like the soft weave i will say the newer soft weave is less soft than the old soft weave at least the one that was on my throne size which is a discontinued side it was a lesser good chair to like bigger ones but i i, I love it and then also nuggy got me the the soft squishy like velvety like feeling arms and i didn't realize how fucking beat to shit my elbows were like i was always getting like funny bone feelings and everything and it was from elbow leaning on my chair all the time and the squishy arms have like changed my body like they're way better shout out to nuggy for getting me a new chair it was like definitely something that i just put on my wish list because i i wanted a new one um, but it was like frivolous like I I felt like oh, I don't need a new chair I do already have a really nice chair. I don't really need it And then he got it for me and I, I almost felt like guilty and then I was like, oh my god It is I didn't realize I had used my chair so much that like and it, again It was their like mini chair because I'm pretty small now Their their smaller chair is like as nice as their larger chairs that like the old one didn't have all the features of like the bigger ones but it fit me so that's why i had that one um this one it fits me really good and it has like all the lumbar and features and stuff and it's actually harder than my other one and i didn't think i would like it, it has way more support it's really great um and it doesn't have a bottom it doesn't bottom out so your butt doesn't go to bed <laughs> but yeah they push by it. i i'm glad you got it what do you think of it you sat in i sit in an office chair that i i, I it, dude i had a I, ikea chair i sat in the first like year of my streaming career down the price even more because it was a bum leg and i got it for five bucks hell yeah see i was in a 20 dollar chair yeah sometimes as the pain gets too much i just uh, the weed i try okay i uh i have nerve damage in my spine and they uh they damaged uh, my occipital nerve and i was in such excruciating pain i developed high blood pressure this year and um i have an aneurysm and uh I was in so much pain, but because of my pre-existing medications and then also the opioid epidemic, nobody would take my pain seriously. And um, I, I did try weed gummies. I never, I never wanted to, and they didn't help. And they like, I, I took, so I kept upping the dose to see if it would like help the pain and then i started to feel like gross and get a different kind of pain like just feel not right and i was like okay that doesn't work for me i can already tell i was i remember because my parents are like super like not into that like they're not at all i'd never tried drugs in my life you know and my mom's like we're getting you weed <laughs> i can't see in this pain anymore we're fucking trying it <laughs> That was I didn't tell Chad at the time. I was it was embarrassed, but yeah. Get the soft weave, dude. You gotta get the soft weave. See, karate knows what's up. I have heard wine or coffee helps with headaches. Actually, I'm a caffeineaholic. Um, so uh, usually when my um heart condition, uh, okay, God, I'm so sorry. We're just going on a tangent. I'm sorry. Hi, Sully. I hope you get rest soon. Sending love. Okay, um. 
So uh, there is an, an anomaly with POTS people. This isn't with all people, but sometimes with uh, your heart condition, actually caffeine lowers it. It's very weird. It's very weird. It's like a thing. And um, so uh, they, um, I went cold turkey when I got diagnosed with my heart condition um, off of caffeine. And there's been several times throughout my, um, since I've been diagnosed where an incident happens and I am like, okay, I'm not going to do any caffeine or I've backed it off again, being like, am I addicted to it? Is it making my migraines? Where Like all those things, right? Where I go a few months. I found that without stimulus, um, my heart is a lot more like pokeable, if that makes sense. So like I'll laugh or I'll get excited or I'll do whatever. And without like a regular stimulus, then I get stuck in a rhythm. Um, and it's a lot more like jumpy, you know, you know what I mean? And uh, it's a lot more easier to like aggravate my conditions. And I find that as I get more stimulus, so you guys will notice this when I'm playing horror games in the beginning, it starts high. And by the end of the stream, uh, I've been scared so many times that my my pulse starts like jumping less and less and less. And I've I've noticed this. And it's the same. It's like your heart is like, oh, this stimuli keeps happening. I don't need to get excited over it. Like, you know what I mean? And then also it just helps my migraine. So I just like fucking live off of salt, caffeine and a dream. <laughs> like That's so crazy. Yeah. Also, wine does. Okay. It's really hit and miss. It's specifically red wine. And it, it will either give me a wine migraine or it'll help. And there's no in between. And and it's just really hit and miss. If it, But sometimes, yeah, a little bit. And well, we're interesting. Yo, we got similar cocktails. Yes. Have a good bath. Thank you again. Hi. All the hugs. Anyway, sending loves. Um, thank you again for the raid. So far, I love this thing. Compared to how I replaced my chair that was actually giving it up the ghost. This is wonderful. If you'll notice that the way they have the butts on them, they are uh suspended and everything. So you actually can't bottom out the ass of the chairs, which is great because I could always feel the bar under my chair. And I my butt would go to sleep, and I can't remember the last time my butt cheeks went to sleep, like sitting on this chair happens more when i'm on the toilet like you know i would always drink caffeine uh coffee for headaches now i drink caffeine sparkling water i have caffeine by the pump yo shout out to lotus not even sponsored if if you so uh, if you don't sometimes caffeine okay okay anyway sometimes you don't feel like drinking a coffee it's too acidic and your migraines making you nauseous and also sometimes soda you don't feel like drinking the bubbles buy this it's it's a little on the fruity side but it's mostly flavorless it's their caffeine fl like f additive so that you don't have to add the flavor of the other lotus stuff and when i am having really nauseous migraine days i drink this in my water and then i can get my caffeine without having to drink a ton of soda um and sugar or uh, or like drink a coffee and it's a it's an energy concentrate and there's 64 servings in this and i highly recommend it i would love one day i'm sure i'll be sponsored by them we've been in talks before but at the time they were too big i love it uh the if you would like to try their flavored stuff uh i have a whole entire coffee bar the like soda bar they have them in cans the cans are really great i haven't tried these two flavors i like them i personally prefer the real sugar um but i'm a real sugar kind of girl but uh they have their energy concentrates which is what they're known for they recently just released their sapphire edition i haven't tried this flavor um and they redid their bottles but and they uh they redid their um their concentrate to actually have more um good stuff in it so there's actually even more like good ingredients in um some of the stuff they just released they re they just recently um redid their their formula and it's like the same great taste allegedly i haven't tried it yet with uh, uh more uh what are the things in like berries and stuff that are good for you antioxidants and stuff anyway it's it's really it's really 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 <laughs> it's really good though um like and uh, uh and yeah i i really i really like it 
And yeah, um, I I love it. I make it with like soda and stuff. If you guys don't want to buy, um, like you, like you you don't want to buy it like because you're like oh it's kind of expensive. It's a half gallon of liquid. That's a lot to invest in without me f like tasting it. Um, almost every single like coffee stand has this. Just search in your local area Lotuses. And, like Lotus Energy and you and go try some of their drinks and see if you like it. They have their own like uh, patented formula for their energy. So you're not just like drinking caffeine. It's like the that's from this or that. They use like the berry from uh, coffee beans. They use tea extract. They use like all these different things. And it's their own patented like uh, formula. I really like it. It doesn't give you like a crash or whatever. And I just like overall love the flavor and stuff. And it's really cost effective if you like would like to replace it. And if you have a soda stream, it's great anyway. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so behind on chat. Um, what do I drink? Da -da -da, my coworker co collapsed yesterday from what? From what? And it's okay to mention a family member passing from drugs and stuff here, or is that no? That's okay. I we definitely like if you want to talk about. I totally that's fine. Uh, we try not to get too traumatic. Like we try to keep everything on the uphill positive thing, but obviously we all have shit that happens and like. We care about all the viewers and stuff. So if you want to talk about it, we're here for you. Uh, and also, if you want to go react, don't worry. Don't worry. Go relax. Get your bath. Have your good de-streaming. Thank you so much again for the raid. Ambulance. And also, Pixie, hello. Sorry, we're just going on a journey tonight. Ambulance took heart monitor up, and she was drinking a lot of energy drinks. And there were, like, have heart irregularity while her GP said it was nothing, even though her dad has a heart. Oh, my God. What? Honestly, I have a all of my my favorite doctor. She uh is my um I guess technically my general practitioner or whatever, but she is a a nurse practitioner, so she's not even fully a doctor. And I will say she's better than all of most of my doctors have been, and I love her for that. She's great. She really gives a fuck. Uh, but it's God that it, heart stuff. I can't say enough. If you are experiencing something, even if it ends up being anxiety, if you are having issues, you're having fluttering, I thought I, I had been told my whole entire life that I had anxiety and that I was just an anxious teenager and that's why I was worked up all the time. And when I had my incident and I had was at PT for another issue... Um, I was, I, I had like 145 BPM laying down, chilling, breathing slowly. And my grandma's always like, oh, breathe. You just need to breathe. I'm like, grandma, your pulse doesn't go down when you have tachycardia, when you deep breathe. If I'm just like, my pulse is still going to be 160. Okay. Like it doesn't work like that anyway. Uh, yeah, just breathe. That's what she thought would fix it. She thought that I was not breathing slowly. <laughs> what are we zooming about? Bark, bark, bark. Boo, boo, boo. Boo. Easy, baby. Easy. Are you making your sissy crazy? Are you giving her the crazy eye? I know you're equally responsible for the naughties. Boop. <laughs> Um, yo, thank you for the raid! Dude, we're just going on a journey. Today's just a just chatting stream. I'm so sorry. I don't even have a coupon! Just, like, go buy whatever you want! <laughs> uh, you're not, uh, thank you so much for the raid! Hello! Hi! Happy belated birthday! How was your stream, Theros? Hello! How was your stream? What were you guys playing? Buy, uh, let Bions be buying a... What, what, how was it? What was it? Tell me all the tea. And if you liked canned energy drinks, you'll probably like white or gold lotus. There you go. Hi, Pixie! It's really good. It's really good. It does... I don't get a buzz, but I'm, like, incapable of getting a caffeine buzz. It, unless I'm on an empty stomach and I, like, pound them. So I'm not necessarily the best. Karate, can you get a buzz off of lotus? Narva, have you ever gotten a buzz off of Lotus? Okay. 
Most people don't, but I mean, um, I'm not a very good candidate to ask because I don't, I don't, I have maybe never, I can count on like my hand how many times I've gotten the jitters from caffeine in my whole entire life. It is a high caffeine amount, so definitely make sure you're counting your caffeine and don't go too crazy. I'm usually math it out. But I've never been an energy drink drinker, but I like that. There's not that much caffeine in a regular serving of Lotus. I mean, it's still a lot considering what your daily recommended. What is it, like under 250? Detective Cyberpunk Noir, the localization is lacking, but it's real vibe. Before that, I was playing... Oh! monster answer too yeah oh there's a second game of that i didn't even i didn't even know and uh cyberpunk noir sounds fun guys please go give all the love also there's an ad about to play let's just finish let oh claims 400 in a day okay well there you go so you would have to drink what five of those serve oh, wait is my math right is eight times five forty <laughs> yeah so you'd have to take do five eighty milligram servings. So yeah, uh, there's an ad about to play. Thank you so much for watching. We'll get back into the game after the ad. Thank you guys for chilling, and we're just vibing up in here. Can energy drinks are like 120 minimum and go up to 200. Oh well, then there you go. <laughs> I meant G. I don't have a G feel thing. Yeah, I started having pre workout for stream sometimes, and turns out there's like three monsters in one scoop. Bro, <laughs> that's why you're fucking buzzing. <laughs> oh, no. Um, Monster Hunter DX on, uh, or Monster Rancher DX on stream has both one and two. Oh, the Lotus servings are just above soda level. Yeah. What is like a, it's like 40 to 60 in a soda can. Can we get another shout out for, um, uh, for Taros? Pretty please. Well, the ad's going. Anyway, um, sorry. We went on a journey. We went on a fucking journey up in here. T. We've done like no gaming in an hour and a half. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. I I hate monster to be honest. I've never been a a, a like a energy drink drinker. I've been a soda person, and that's really it. But oh, what I was saying is, if you think you have heart heart issues, if you get fluttery off of things, like those are not things to good be good to continue. If you get caffeine buzzes all the time, that's not good for you, right? Um, I'm definitely a bit of an anomaly because I I have overactive kidneys. So my body just shits out everything. Hydration, electrolytes, you know, vitamins, minerals, protein, like whatever. I, I definitely have um, an interesting metabolism for that stuff. And so I'm not quite the best person to, to, to base your caffeine intake off of. But I will say that I, I do uh, enjoy that as a replacement for sometimes my gut just doesn't want to drink coffee. It's too acidic or something. Bless you. And um, I, or the smell is too pungent. It gets me nauseous. And I, I use, typically replace it with, uh, with Lotus, which is nice. Yeah, energy drinks, uh, kind of yucky. Make me sleep. Interesting. Wait, so pre-workout doesn't make you sleepy, but energy drink does. That's so interesting. Do you have ADHD? Are you one of those where it's like a downers or uppers and uppers or downers for you? No, but alcohol makes you sleepy too, right? Or no? <laughs> just go outside and praise the sun. Get your photosynthesis on. I had one time and then I was tired from coffee. Uh, I, I went through a phase when I was, I forget what, me I was on a medication and it made uh, stuff make me sleepy. To be fair though, I'd, okay, I can pound a Coke, like chug it or drink a coffee, like a double shot coffee, espresso, and then go to take a nap. Maybe. People tell me I have ADHD. Alcohol doesn't make me sleepy. I've just heard that complaint from a lot of those people. Um, alcohol makes me sleepy, though. I'm not fun. Buzz. What are you two doing? Crazy. Crazy. Crazy poopers. Hello. You might be crazy. Think you're pooping. 
smashing your cupcake on my rug. Yeah. It's a link for a poo. It's a scoop a poo. Poop a doop a poo a poo a doop a poo. Hi. All right, anyway, let's get back into the game and actually play Eggro. Hello. Thank you guys so much for watching the ad and, and everything. I appreciate it. Some people think Monster tastes like gasoline. Bro, that's like having that gene that makes Brussels sprouts taste bad or something. I don't know. Hmm, interesting. And alcohol doesn't make me... Uh, dude, it makes me sleepy. <gasps> Oh shit, do we, do we need, th that's the, that's one of the hands of the clock, yeah? Okay. Do you think we just shoot it down? Well, that was a waste. Definitely a puzzle, eh? Whoever tried castle. <laughs> Maybe they think it tastes the way it smells, right? <laughs> Like, I mean, it's just dangling there. Can I not, like, I don't really want to waste ammo. Chat, can somebody tell me if I'm supposed to shoot it? Or is it another solution? It's not shooting. I'm assuming uh, it's not. Because we need, we need that hand. It's one of the hands to the clock. Gas in your mouth by accident? True. Or maybe you're like siphoning gas. And you... Okay, we need the pump though for that. Ah. Uh, the solution is, is this crank. Okay. We won't waste shots. I think raspberries occasionally taste like blood. Uh, and I googled it. Sometimes certain uh, raspberries... Ah! Occasionally, apparently... Oh. Raspberries have more iron content in them than others. I mean, it's like... um, Like if you're a perfume maker or something, right? There's only... There's like so many nodes of things that create other things, right? Surely that is like part of it. I don't know. Oh, dear God. I thought he was dead. That's a, what a waste. You know. I think, hey Mizu, what word can you make for from Gmail? What? From Gmail? Like it's like a like a word? <laughs> That's not a word. Monkey! Irrigate, hello! I love oh 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 have you played it already? Have you finished it? Will you will you be my back my professional backseater, please and thank you? I chat does it flush! No it doesn't! The amount of toilets in this game to not be able to flush at least one of these fuckers. Anyway, please be my professional um backseater. Thank you. Pomegranate is what comes the closest to blood for me. See, I could see that too, though. You see that too. I mean, you think about it, everything's made up of different makeups, you know? So, oh, that's where we're at. Okay, now we have the key to like, whatever, 06. All right. Definitely tastes like blood sometimes. Google it, Google it. Raspberries, high iron content. <laughs> I don't even think, ah! Okay, these ones can get shot. Ah. Oh, I wasted an extra bullet. I only needed three and I needed four for that. Dude. 
I'm not a fan of this bullshit. Have you know? Where are they at? How many? Come on, can you just come over here? Because I bet, I bet there's more than one. Oh! I wasted an extra bullet because I pre I preloaded up my okay we're gonna hit this one okay I'm wasting so many bullets I guess I I we get a lot of bullets it feels like we get more bullets than we get heals you know so well is there another one in here me trying to heal with the reload button. Okay, we still have 18. Hmm. Okay, why do raspberries sometimes taste like blood? It can sometimes taste like blood due to a compound called geosmin, which is also found in beets. Geosmin is produced by certain bacteria and fungi in the soil and can give fruits and vegetables an earthy taste. So some perceive similar to- <gasps> You know they use beets uh the and that the one of the enzymes in beets to make fake meat right because it has that bloody the flavor from beets and the color and stuff but like it's like what the color comes from This is a nice toilet, at least. There's extra paper for my diarrhea. Dude, why are there so many bathrooms in this fucking... What's in the bathroom? Like, I can't crouch for a false sense of security. Where's the crawler? I know there's fucking. But there's the. There's the four-legged one somewhere. my light off and 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 just stopped playing yo game would you like to uh take me to a safe location or okay you did where am i ah okay that's nice <laughs> I've only died maybe, what, ha half a dozen to a dozen times in this game, which I will say is shocking. I, knock on wood. I, and I, I forgot. Ah, uh, it was already dead. I didn't need three shots. This game makes me want to play The Last of Us. Can I can I tell you see oh I don't think it's a secret. I think you know. I saw something in that. I think it was a light anomaly. Um My mom bought me The Last of Us because she read about like how it was like critically acclaimed and, and all that, you know? And then 
There's a kicker here, right? And I started playing it, and I got to the area where it's like teaching you how to distract stuff with a brick. Oh wait, it's this one, right? One of them comes to life. And the NPC keeps fucking The NPC keeps fucking um Wait, I don't have the key. What? Aww, what? Okay. The NPC, we're so far back. Jeez, that sucks. Um, the NPC keeps freaking like making making the the like like notifying all the zombies and the clickers over and over and over again. Like freaking endlessly. It's so annoying. I don't know why. It's the worst. And I just got stuck there and I was scared and I never played again. Like you're supposed to distract them with a brick. It's in the very beginning of the game. You're supposed to distract them with a brick. I throw the brick and then they move. And then she just walks over as I'm crouching and like hiding. She just like doo -doo -doo -doo, walks over right in front of it, triggers it and we die. I just ultra suck at distract. I, yeah, I forgot. Sorry. Okay, now we have it. Okay, I'm gonna beat him this time. Okay, well. Are you fucking farting in my butt cheeks? Well, I've already wasted more heals than before while trying to save ammo like a ding dong. <sighs> I guess we weren't that far behind. Uh, na, 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 na. Now? Yeah, the legged one is is moved. <gasps> I wasted bullets. Hi, Will. What doing? He says, I smell steak. I smell steak. I want some for me to eat. I am Linker Poo. And I, I will, 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 will. At you, even if you poo. Well, if you suck at distracting stuff, have fun with The Last of Us. Yeah, dude, can he just eat the, 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 the carpet mush cupcake instead? Did you see the videos I sent you? Of the, the shenanigans that we got down to? Oh my god. <gasps> I one shot at it! I had 18 shots at this before. Now I'm over here like... 1-1 one, one on the... <sighs> Waiting for this to dissipate so I don't walk over it and die is fun. At least we got some more heals. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just being grumpy. It's fine. We get more bullets. It's fine. You can only hold like 20 bullets at a time anyway, including what you have like preloaded. So, oh, we have 18 now. We're literally back to where we started, except for maybe like one short heal. It's fine. Okay. Stepper. Right there, it's gonna move. Pre-scripted. 
There's the gloop. This one, does this one come back? This one comes to life, right? That might have been a waste. Cassie, I, I need the hammer. Please fix it. A couple, just tap it, yeah. Did the one on the right come to life? Who wants to bet? Dude, I shot you in the head already. Worth. I missed, fuck. Did Zora just grunt? Did did you guys hear that? I, I thought something was like talking behind me and I look and I'm pretty sure she she likes to make like these loud grunts as she like slams her body to the floor and I'm pretty sure that's what I heard but it scared the literal bejeebers out of me. Like I thought that like something was like someone was in my room. I like what I oh scared me. Okay. <sighs> Woo! As you can see, because my pulse was up there. Hi, Cassie! Dude, yeah. Uh, please bonk me in the head until it stops. Sorry, that's probably... You know what? I'm going to get banned on Twitch for saying you can't make jokes like that, right? You didn't hear it? That Maybe it didn't come through. Oh, it scared me. So bad. I feel like I'm I'm kind of worried. I feel like I need to like actually like severely watch what I say on Twitch now after all the bans lately. I'm like low key like spooked about like the like destructive behavior um bans I've seen. Like, of course, there's, like, the inappropriate, like, like, it, like, people have, like, if you make a joke and you don't have, like, I guess the sexual themes tag on your stream or something or mature themes, like, I don't know. What if I'm playing a mature game? Do I have to turn that on? I don't know. It makes me a little bit worried. I guess, you know what? We'll cross that bridge when we get there, right? Like that, the one girl who made the, was t thanking her community for all they do. He peeked it. And they said it was like suicidal. Yeah, no, it literally warned me when I started upstream that it was it was mature content. So the mature theme is on. But now I, I, I don't know. Oh, I didn't mean to heal. I clicked the wrong button. I don't know. It, I feel like my content in the context is like pretty PG most of the time, except for swearing. Oh, I didn't go in here again. Cool. But, I don't know, I guess you never know. I guess it's one of those things we'll cross that bridge when we get there, right? Worst the, it would be, it would be a week off. If I had a month off, I would complain. I know enough people. I'm sorry, that sounds really spoiled. I, I feel like I could contact, I, I could contact somebody to like, I, I, I can't imagine ever, oh my God, I need to, what? Can we just be done? I've wasted so many bullets. Holy shit. Nice. I should have just went and, and whatever. Whatever. I didn't hear. My cat snores loud and scares the shit out of me. Right? It, it means you get banned. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Yo, it should be auto it, auto turned on. Yeah, I totally nukes your live views, unfortunately. That's true. Oh, yeah. And it also unsubs everybody. 
who whose subs roll over during that time because apparently it also happens for someone who snor smokes on stream and i mean normal cigarettes it says are drug abuse wait really people okay i'm gonna be honest no offense to any of the vapors out there i i definitely don't the, like it's unattractive to see someone vaping on their stream i don't know why i'm just being real with you like people people who who do it but it's like why is that any different how is it any different smoking a cigarette versus vaping i mean i know it's different but to twitch it shouldn't be Good thing I'm a, okay, no, no, people who casually vape and IRL, I don't mind, like, but I remember one time I knew someone who vaped all the time, and they were always just in the mic, and, the, and I just, And I'm like, it's so weird because, like, I've vaped before. Like, I don't really care, but I, I definitely always just, like, was, like, I side-eyed. I can't. I judged it every time I go in their stream. And it was, like, all the time. It wasn't like they just casually, like, you know, like a drinking on your drink. It was always, like, <laughs> like, in the mic and then blowing it all over the And I just found it so fucking distracting. Anyway. <laughs> Dude, which which all are suck, so if they ever ban you, they will suck even more. <laughs> Wait, that's so crazy though. Cigarettes are not illegal though. And anywhere, really. Or that's that's odd. I find that really odd. Vaping is better than... I agree. I agree. I think it just also is not necessarily good for you either. No offense. That's why you guys should get um fume. Kick those bad habits with flavored air. Nicotine addiction. Addiction is bad. Anyway. Good thing I ain't attractive. Jerry, I'm sorry. I've never seen you vape now that I think. I never notice it. Um, but yeah, that's crazy. I saw someone smoke. Dude, I've seen, uh, th like, yeah, people, like, do drugs and do whatever. And they're like, yeah, but, like, somebody's, like, sipping some wine and they're, like, ban. And I'm like, I think it's mostly VTubers lately who I've been seeing. But I'm also only noticed VTubers. But, like, I'm not one to say this. But I feel like I've seen men, like, very large men content creators do some very suspicious shit on the platform and i'm not usually one to call like sexist vibes or whatever but like a vtuber like sings a pg song but they they think it's inappropriate out of context because they didn't watch the whole thing and then they get banned and i'm just like i just genuinely it makes it really i <laughs> I I genuinely keep I need to stop looking at like doom scrolling on Twitter and reading all the things because I I feel like I, I don't know the whole situation and maybe I'm only seeing it from the context of the creator and I wasn't there and obviously can't go back and watch it because they got banned like I can't fact check it or whatever and it's never happened to me and it's never happened to my friends that like I personally know to like talk to them but it's literally put the fear of god into me because like twitch is my career and my only income and I'm like if I just make an oopsie joke like they're gonna ban me for 30 days like and then all of my reoccurring subs get canceled too and everything like your job you just get fired for a month out of something that's not even like contextually oh thank you other people are fine with like it really scares me i'm gonna be honest with you like i'm sure i'd be fine and y'all are cuties you'd be like yo send me the paypal like but it's definitely scary 
I guess you're right. Like, the whole community would be pissed if that happened. And also, I'm fairly confident that I have the, like, tools available to me and the the know-with-all to reach out, understand the situation, and either apologize or get it resolved. And perhaps the other bands that we witness are mistakes, and you just need to ask politely to to have it reevaluated and then when they do it's fine you know which a lot of like I, I, I so maybe my fear is coming from people like throwing tantrums on twitter i don't know the full situation and i wasn't there and they fixed it later but it does put the fucking fear of god on me do you do you know what i mean that it's like i don't know does that make sense? Anyway, I don't vape. I just regular smoke, dude. I didn't even know you did that. I I had no idea. <laughs> See, you're not over here just like puffing like clouds into the camera. The <laughs> I know, but yeah. I never seen the appeal of drugs, cigs, or booze or anything. Honestly, it's it's more of like a social thing. I think more than anything for a lot of people. I feel very offended. <laughs> always the accidents that get banned yeah dude it's uh, well it's funny because the people who intentionally do really like on the line stuff it's like like the like the bikini streamers who showed their vajayj i, I like to get a, like a 24-hour ban or less than a week and then someone made a joke about their like suicidal thing like issues and how their community saved them and was a little drunk and they got banned for like bad behavior and like harmful behavior to themselves i'm like i'm not trying to be mean because i do think like that that can be triggering for some people and like maybe that's just a line rice thank you for the follow sorry coming in when i'm like kind of venting yeah we all know that vtuber i, I wasn't there i've never seen their content i don't know what the context was i don't know what the stream is but i think let's be honest let's say that person was genuinely really struggling i don't think taking away their only source of revenue and support system for 30 days or whatever it was wasn't it 30 days is appropriate like instead i think oh why is there not warnings why don't oh is a week okay a week that is a lot I, I guess not super but still why is there not a warning system where you get an email and a flag on your account and like i'll help like 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 a like a center you're supposed to dm and to understand what you did wrong if you've never although has that creator done other bad stuff before and gotten in trouble i don't know but yeah that's kind of how i feel it's just kind of odd but yeah i have seen 30 days slapped but then the people who like i guess it, how much money they make the create like whatever and people are like well it's always been that way go stream in the bikini section or go do whatever and i'm like if i can go to walmart and people are dressed more scandally clad than the vtubers getting banned i think that they're and and the like real bodies are allowed to get away with more than fictitious ones i think that there's a problem i'm sorry like my mom's like not into the tea and she's like shouldn't like virtual like unreal bodies get away with more than like real ones because it's worse like it's more it's like not a real thing it's a cartoon character like you know, I know the more realistic things get, but then you can play really mature games too. It just, I don't know. It's weird. Anyway. You should listen to Nerva more and don't stress about it. That's true. We'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. <laughs> Ask for forgiveness when that happens. But yeah. You gotta be perfectly blunt and honest with you. You're not big enough to Twitch to care about the soft gaffes that you make on stream. I would hope so. But then also, if you're too small, then you can't get it fixed <laughs> if someone if it does. But yeah, it's weird that the way the streaming is going, I feel like the majority of it is like degenerates on kick. Yeah, 
I think it's weird because a lot of the top streamers on Twitch also do questionable things. And I'm like, like, for instance, like, I just saw a reel of everybody, like, gushing over how, like, Kai Sanat is, like, the wholesomest, like, creator ever, you know? And, like, he's, like, there's, like, a video reel of him, like, lighting fires in his house. Is that not self-destructive behavior? Is Why is that allowed for, like, somebody talking, like, drinking a couple, like, beers? Or smoking a cigarette, but, like, you might fucking light your house on fire. And, like, do you have roommates? Do you have pets? Do you have houses near you? Like, do our, pe our children get to copy you because they're going to light a fucking fire in their house, too? Like, I, I don't know. I just, I'm, like, that, like, that was on Twitch. I don't know. Yeah, they're really inconsistent. I don't understand. Well, they specifically call out VTubers, too, and I'm like, so, should we, like, they should just rename Hot Tub Streams to, like, I, I can't even say it on Twitter, or on Twitch. <laughs> That's what it seems like. It's very inappropriate over there. I, 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 I don't think that that kind of content should be allowed on the platform at all. I think it's disgusting. I, that, go to Pornhub. Yeah, it's, like, I've streamed the hot tub streams because I, as a joke, I think, like, tasteful, like, a little bit of, like, sus content is fine, but the fact that you're just staring, there's literally a clause inside the, the TOS that says that you can't focus on sexualized areas of the body, so boobs and butt, but their camera is literally just boobs and butt. So that, that already just makes no sense. Corporate changing their policies of how they enforce a rule. It only gets solved by content creators on... Yeah, it's just, it just really sucks. Because it's like the people who aren't trying to push the limits, they're punishing. And then the people who do push the limits intentionally, they're like slap on the wrist. Just refuse to show exactly what they are or aren't okay with. Yeah, it's because they, it's because it makes money. So it, it's like they're throttling it, but the money-making ones, I, I don't know. You couldn't even see the VTuber drinking. It's insane. It's called self-destructive behavior. Yeah, it's weird. And then they pedaled back on the rule because you couldn't drink for, um, for, for subs. And then they pedaled that back. They said you just couldn't drink irresponsibly, and then they just reversed that again. Which is fine, but... Maybe it's like a league download or anything. If I can see it in a PG-13 movie, it should be allowed on Twitch. Maybe. Maybe not. Within reason. I mean, like, attire-wise. I guess boobs are allowed. Aren't they? So maybe not. You want the reactivated and DM or in mod page? Uh, the what? Anyway, sorry. I'm I'm being. I'm sorry for being. Con I did not mean to take my heels. Sorry for being controversial. I just. I'm not trying to be. I just I just find. Make it make sense. That's all. Make it consistent. Make it whatever. <laughs> And also, they change the TOS so often, and it's not like these changes, like, the only reason I know they change it is because I see it on Twitter. So to me, I'm like... And let's say- oh my god. Wait, did we die? We must have. Or I haven't made it to where I thought I was. I thought I was done. Ow, fuck. I'm wasting my bullets. I'm wasting my heels, I'm wasting my bullets. Anyway. No, you brought up some good points, I agree. I'm sorry. I, I, I really do feel like I'm trying to be reasonable though, because like from a company standpoint, right? Let's talk about like in realisticness. We're talking about we want branding, we want this, we want that. Whatever. 
but like I, I I let's let's be reasonable. It's like, am I supposed to read the TOS every single fucking day? It's not like I got any. I, I don't think I got an email that's like, and and they ch the, lately the last few months they've been changing it almost every day. Am I supposed to read the whole entire document and and scrub it just in case I I miss something every day? Do you, do you know what I mean? It's just unrealistic. So unless you're like socially uh, adept enough like to, to be doing it, the amount of times they're changing it so often makes it even more hard. People act like, like, so I'm just like, it's hard. It's hard to keep up. And I think that it's like context should matter. And I was in a call with Twitch staff before and they said that you can't, you can't get like harassed to the point of getting um banned like if someone like mass reports you it does that their ban system doesn't work and they hand do every single thing so that like uh that's like a wives tale that technically it doesn't work like that and you that you cannot get harassed banned on their platform because a person a human like does check every single report right so I felt like a lot more confident and safe. I was like cradled in the arms of Twitch. You, you know what I mean? And then, and then lately I've seen some and then they're like, whoops, uh, context, we'll like reverse that. And I'm like, if context matters, that doesn't make sense. I don't know. Um, anyway, let's talk about happier things and not piss off my... I don't want to bite the hand of feet. I, I think that within reason, I understand that the the platform needs to be profitable. It needs it needs to make sense, and I'm okay with that. But it is still scary to feel as though my livelihood could implode upon oh my god that is so scary was that there before could implode on a dime because i misunderstood and made a pp joke do you, do you know what I, do you know what i mean like that's all or 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 i let someone in a voice call onto my stream and they said something. Even though, like, you know, people have had, like, a booba slip on stream and they've not been banned. <laughs> because they, it was like, I'm so sorry, that was an accident. Like, because accidents happen. Like, it wasn't intentional. I don't know. I like to think that everybody has good intentions. And I really hope that <sighs> right now what's happened is there's just a misconstruing of information behind the scenes and there's a lot of new staff members because of how rapid the growing of the thing is and i'd like to hope that it's just a miscommunication and that the team just needs to really work on coming together for having equal ideas and thoughts on on what is okay and what's not and i hope they come together to for to to make it better for everybody and 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 fair you know and i guess like you know i i've had uh, okay i backtrack way too much i've had a little bit of like edgy content a little sussy con a little fan service here and there and i haven't ran into issues you know and i know i've been reported before so it's just, you know, I guess I don't know because I don't watch any of the creators I've seen have this issue except for Elena Lazar. So uh, here's the cheers to hoping that, you know, it it's meant well to keep everyone safe and that they just come together and have good ideas that that make everybody safe and happy and are are more fair in the future and they just like whoever is being a little nitpicky harsh and and stuff you know maybe maybe they it gets better you know um i don't know 
I'd like to be optimistic, but prepared for it not to be that way. Does that make sense? But I feel like, I know that little changes, they don't always tell you. I definitely get emails and stuff. But also, it would be nice if like the big TOSs that affect you should be like maybe in the notification in your Twitch dash dashboard that you interact with all the time. I feel like that would be nice. But anyway, you're very wholesome. I feel like you couldn't, you wouldn't have to worry so much. But yeah, the beach and hot tub stuff is just outright exploiting people. Yeah. Um, no VTuber hips. Uh, about the hot tub and VTuber new rules on Twitch. Oh, okay. I'll watch it. I'll watch it. Is it okay if we watch it later? I feel like I've talked about it too long. I'm sorry. Uh, you brought up good points. I agree. And why can't the, they think over it and change it once a year or something? Yeah, I understand that like little things could be tweaked and changed. And also there's like legality, right? Like, like, and I understand that like, but I wish that like companies are so sterile sometimes. And, and so not like, I know you have a board of directors. You have a board of investors and people who own pieces of the company you have different people wanting different things for success different opinions different whatever or you can't make everyone happy having a larger ability for audience is um better for income and the platform as a whole. So compromises are good. All I care about is I find it long story short, I find it stupid that a face cam streamer can get away with lewd content. A VR chat streamer can do lewd content. Who's to say I'm not in VR chat? Just saying. And then a man can get away with a joke. You know. That's all I have to say. And I usually... Never. You guys should watch my channel. I never go the sexist route. Ever. Very rarely. But I do notice it a little bit. Lately. Off of the bands I've seen. A man face camera would, could say the same joke that... It, Someone gets banned for him. But yeah. Do you like MMOs? You know, I like the idea of MMOs, but I never have do ever dived into one long enough. That's like the DJ program. You're meant to be constantly checking your playlist. Yeah, no, that seems not good for 90% of the platform. And... It really feels like people who don't DJ, it's like, what are, what are you supposed to join it if you ever decide to play music on your platform? That seems really weird. And that, like, it does it make all of your income less? It's written in a really scary way. I agree. Oops, the camera, <laughs> my band hammer wants names. Who reported? <laughs> Well, one time another, uh, a Naraka partner decided to go hog wild and report me on every platform. That was fun. Because I called them cringe. Because <laughs> they were mad that I didn't follow them on all their platforms. Only, only, you know, like three out of five. And I, and they kept bugging me. And I said, you know what? I Please stop asking me. And they freaked out. Told me I was a fake ass bitch for saying I'm supportive when I'm obviously not because I wouldn't follow their Instagram and TikTok. And I'm like, I don't use Instagram and TikTok. And they're like, but you have, then why don't you follow me there? And I said, Nerva runs my Instagram and TikTok. If I'm being honest, I don't know. Uh, please stop asking me. I'm streaming right now. He waited till I was live. And then I called him cringe. And then he spent the whole entire day harassing my mods while I was doing an event uh, anniversary stream. <laughs> That was my four-year anniversary, I think, on Twitch. He spent the whole entire day harassing us and arguing and saying that I was a fake-ass bitch. I am not you told me you reported me on every platform in hopes that I lose all my brand deals and get fired. 
That is cringe. That's what I'm saying. I feel like that behavior is like psycho behavior. That is fucking cringe. Waiting till someone goes live to DM them and tell them just reminding you. And every time I go live, you do it in my chat too. By the way, you still haven't followed my TikTok. I'm like, I follow you on YouTube. I follow you on Twitter and I follow you on Twitch and I raid you all the time. Is that not enough for you? You're a two-faced psycho bitch. How fucking dare you? You act like you care about people, but you won't even follow my TikTok. Okay, buddy. I like all your content. Uh, that, the... Okay. I don't do follows for follows. Sorry. <laughs> Make everyone happy. The only thing I worry about is, the, the, is that. Yeah, it's it's rough anyway okay we'll we'll talk about more happy stuff but yeah throwing and liberty is it free i didn't realize the game was through i've been seeing everybody play it have you guys been enjoying throwing and liberty and then he proved how cringe he was i mean and then i had to apologize to make him get over it and i i'm gonna be honest i don't really feel like i had anything to apologize to i just told him it was cringe and then i closed my discord and then I didn't look at it. I didn't do anything. And stop her saying no. That man's a fucking walking predator. He doesn't know the meaning of no. From a woman. Dude, most of the people aren't that bad. There's just a lot of loud bad eggs. Okay. Chat, what do I need to do? Because I'm just dying. <laughs> Now it's funny. Now it's funny to talk about it, but when it happened, I was incredibly uncomfortable. He continued to harass me for months, too. And it got to the point where uh, when I went to TwitchCon that year, I was really scared he was going to try to confront me in person. And But then he ended up not going, so that was that was good. I, I, I genuinely got to the point that I was a bit scared for my, like, personal safety because he just kept, like, bugging me. Huh, Link. Link, are you gonna beat him up? You guys want to see a husky begging for for prime cut of steak? <laughs> Would you like a piece of steak, good sir? Hmm. Oh. Can you? I mean, he was banned, but he would also just continue. I ha I work in the same area with him, so I still have to deal with him. Because unlike him, I'm not a psycho. And I didn't report him. So I still had to be in the same circle of people as him. You know. In other people's streams. In game. In the Rock a Partner program. But. It was okay. He probably, you know what? Now I don't really care. I think it's funny. It makes good content to talk about, right? U.S. West server. I'm on the U.S. West. Yo, I'm on the. I'm U.S. West. So that's perfect. Put a fan outside and push the fog away, then we can escape. Especially on PS5, easy for controls. Ooh. That's another thing about this generator. You can just gotta make sure who you around you, uh, who is around you all the time. Yeah. Especially at cons like that. Yeah. Wait, same area in game. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, we've done like nothing. I'm also just a really paranoid person and as like in my core, like my natural, like, okay, maybe, maybe I'm in the right location. I died a lot and then I died and then I didn't remember what I had done. And then now I'm like low on health and, and everything. So we need another clock hand. Sorry, God, we went on a journey chat. We've, we were like two hours of the three, like two and a half hours of the stream has just been chatting about health and twitch stuff and then weirdos 
What is it? Are you happy snorting? Has it been a great birthday week, my love? Linker Poo turned 10 years old. And he, uh, chat, can you, every, uh, chat, everybody t tell Linker Poo happy birthday and, and tell me he doesn't look great for his age. <laughs> you want to say hi? Look up here. He was doing bunny hops in my, in my, uh, room earlier today. To cheer me up and cuddling me. Dude, isn't he so handsome? Isn't he just the bestest? <coughs> so, um, on the, on the 6th was his gotcha day. Cause that's when I adopted him. Uh, nine years ago. And we have, a, we only have an estimate. So, but yeah, he's about 10, which is crazy. You look like you're five. M the mommy and you, mommy and you are getting old. We're old little farts now, baby. <laughs> he's a good boy. He's the best. I'm sorry. I forgot about you, sissy. I know you turned six months old. How, it, the, the, chat, everybody say happy six month birthday. She's a half. <laughs> what? You're half a husky butt. <laughs> what are you doing, Psycho? Oh, she's cute, but a psycho. A little bit psycho. A little zo, 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 zo. <laughs> oh, she's a but a psycho. A little bit psycho. It's just a puppy, puppy, puppy butt. That good but crazy Azora. Puppy, a linker poo. Puppies are psycho, a little bit psycho. Why do I keep getting all the husky puppies? <laughs> there you go. That was the that was the the husky psycho song. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> Two hours of stalling. Hell yeah. Have I already done that? Yeah, I'm like, I'm like lost in the sauce. I'm sorry. So, someone on Naraka thought I was a girl and kept harassing me to play. Shh, sweet little zip. <laughs> He's on my leg, giving. A j I only have two more. St I only have. One, I only have one more piece of steak. Maybe I want this steak. This is my lunch! You've already had your cake! I didn't even have cake! Chat, do you see what it's like in my house? Do you, do you see what I have to deal with? Do you see what I have to deal with, chat? Do you see, do you see the kind of crap that I'm dealing with here? Dear God, help me! Okay. You guys have to share. All right. No one make fun of my bald head. Zozo, you want one piece? As you can see, my dogs, my dogs are, um, they are very dapper and, um, and they, dude, um, they, uh, they, they like it. gentlemen and gentle ladies. They eat off of a fork as, as all sophisticated poopas do. You guys are so cute. I'm too lazy to like double, triple, quadruple check. I don't flash my face on the screen. So it's like, you get, you get, what do you get? You know what I look like. I don't care. I'm chronically ill. Get over it. <laughs> I know. They're little good boys. I swear to God, people like that make more of the head. This is more, more of a cat person. What? Dude, if anyone's a cat, it's my dogs. <laughs> She's a professional staller. You know it. Okay, chat. What do I do? 
It was like everything is checked off. God damn it, there's an ad. I'm snoozing it. Nah, you guys are cute. Mwah. Kisses. Seriously though, what do I do? What do I do? This that's so creepy though. <laughs> what crap doggy needs food? It's normal. Mine is the same. We love your head. Thank you. I regret to say I have no idea. <laughs> Dude, I'm not gonna lie, the creepy zipping comment really disturbs me just a little bit. God damn, that is really creepy. All right, what do I what do I do, chat? I need the back seating and I need it now. Like, I'm uh, uh, I don't know what you've done so far. You know what? We died, and then I had to redo some stuff, and so now I don't know what we've done so far. I thought you... you. No, we already did the thing. We have one of the... We Okay, I, I can tell you. I only have one of the clock hands. He's giving me the creep. You know what? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave this here. Okay, so that you guys know the kind of distraction I'm dealing with here, okay? I can't fucking focus, man. Hour or minute? Hour. <laughs> the smaller one. Why is the hour smaller than the minute? <laughs> is it because the... the <laughs> Is it, shh, no barks. Is it because, is it because, I can't focus, oh my god. Um, is it because, like, the, 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 the hour has to, it, like, is, like, in less segments than the minutes, so then, because of that, um, oh my god, is it, now, oh, I figured it out. Do we need to go down? Is there a toilet you can search? Excuse me, there's a toilet you can search? I, I think, I think I just figured it out. Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, I can go in the H door now, dear God. Okay, I figured it out. The staircase came down and I didn't realize. Okay. I thought they just came down so I could go up. Um, what was I saying? I don't know. I can't keep, I, I'm so distracted today. It's the migraine. Blame it on the migraine. Uh oh. Don't blame it on me. Don't blame it on me. Don't blame it on me. We got a puzzle with all the birdies. I hope that we can. You know, let's be honest. We, you guys don't come here for the gameplay. Come on. I'm about to have three monsters with hell yeah. Yo, if you start exp experiencing chest pains, fluttering, uncomfortableness of the, of the heart, you're not allowed to to have any more pre workout. I'm banning you. Okay, I'm just letting you know that right now. Okay, the minute hand is smaller because it moves more. Has to be closer to. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> But you know what? In theory, it's kind of weird seeing the, um... It's kind of funny and weird seeing the... The hour. When I always have to think about it, because the hour, you would think, would be bigger. I guess it's fatter. Oh. Does it flush? Does it flush? It doesn't. Oh, wait. I did all the wrong buttons. But... Oh, dear God. Bro, you know what? In situations like... You know what? It feels like the Splatoon all over again. Dude, you know what? Oh, you go so deep! How many inches? Oh, my God. I don't want to look at it. Okay, I was eating. Oh no, I forget Linkerpoo loves scary games, chat. 
Why is this room ugly? Why is this room ugly? There's a, 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 not the ads. <laughs> One, two, buckle my shoe. That was some projectile. See, that's what happens when it's a shart and not a fart. I'm just letting you know. There's the difference, in case you were wondering. Okay, there we go. Oh, I can smell that from here. Dude, that... The, the, you, this whole entire room was pretty, but now it's not. Dude, I'm just... I'm just dying. Uh, okay, that means this door's unlocked now. Um... He really likes scary games, and he likes scaring me. That's why he's getting all worked up. It's the food, but it's also the adrenaline of the scare. Look at him. He thinks he's he thinks he's cool. Look at him. But I like to scare him back. Sometimes he 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 scares me, and he he tries to woo me awake, and I pretend to be asleep until he gets really close to my bed, and then I jump scare him back. Boo! I think I failed. I don't think I <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm mean. He starts bouncing and then he does like a tippy toe where he like ugh, stretches to try to peek over the edge of my bed because I have a really like thick comforter. And he peeks and he peeks and he like holds his breath. You stir. You just pawed my leg. What do you want, you gremlin? Okay. Boop. Food time! Food time! We just get ads and goggles. Boop boop. Boop boop. 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 Puppy cleanse. Chad, this has been the weirdest stream ever. I apologize. Thank you. Is you so sweet? Is you my sweet bee? Is you my sweet pea? Boop boop boop. Boop 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 boop. Boop. Says mommy no more boop in my snoot. Hi Alma! How is your queen of Alma doing? Hello? What? What was that Tootser doing? Wait, I don't have any more. It's my baked potato. I... <laughs> I'm not sharing my baked potato just yet. You have to wait. I'm not ready for it yet. What? 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 You want me to hold you? Are you scared from the scary game? Give me the toots. Give me the toots. Give me. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Sissy, are you jealous? Do you do you need a bushy? Boop. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching the ad. And I hope you're enjoying the puppy cleanse. Ah. <sighs> I don't think it's weird. You you do you derail a lot so uh, of time. So I would say it's a, a normal stream mood, mood me, uh, attempting to not need or er, attempting to think of the 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 audio anomaly just started happening. What? Boop. I love you. No more. All gone. All gone. Go eat your cupcake that you smushed on my floor. <laughs> the dog had a look. I, I, I have so many nose boops. I will have my revenge plotting jump scare. Dude, have you guys seen the clip of him doing that? Does anyone have the linker poo scare from Observer? Somebody should share that because that literally he loves nothing more than to intentionally jump scare me. He no, he does it on purpose. He does it in real life all the time too. And then he bounces like he bounces like a bunny. Are you... No touch my plate. That's mine. That's my baked potato. Sir. Do you want mustard sauce? Is that what you're wanting this whole time? 
Oh. Yeah, you want Dijon garlic butter sauce? You shouldn't have that much garlic, but oh, yeah, just a little taste. He just wanted the, the garlic butter. You guys have never had a, a fancy Dijon sauce? Okay, here is him jump scaring. I want you to pay attention to as he enters the screen. Look at him. And then watch his response as he, he successfully scares me. He leaves, comes back into frame, woos, then runs away. He's a- he, look at that! He's such a troll! Okay, I don't- Okay, I don't hear the anomaly. I was double checking, I thought. What a not See? That's what- I, dude, he does it. He- you don't- I don't have that many we've caught on camera. And now I'm a VTuber, so it happens less. But he- he revels. He revels in a good jump scare. He does- he thinks he's funny. If you can't tell. He thinks- he is not a troll. That's a good boy. A boy who knows what's- it. he's very intelligent. Um, the day of his birthday, I had- I had been streaming. I don't know if you guys remember, I- I kept talking about the next day that we'd be going out and stuff. Oh, nice. Is that the bird we need? Yep. Something's gonna grab us. Or something out of there. Great. Oh, it's a part? We need more. What the f Chad, did you guys see that? I'm focusing because we're gonna die. And I don't have any more heals. Anyway. Okay, the audio glitch is happening. I knew it. I knew it. My controller tells me how healed I am. The color of it. Look, it's red now. It was yellow earlier. No more heals because I failed. I am uh, like a pooper. And now my VC face is gonna crash. And then he is gonna jump scare me. But yeah, he does this thing and he likes to scare me. Also, he's very... So I've had a lot of health incidents in front of him. And so now he's very aware of like what's going on. Bless his heart. But he likes to check on me in my sleep. And sometimes he just like silently stares at me. And Nerva finally had it happen to him. One time when he's sleeping in my room. And he woke up and Nerva's like... And he's like... Like, Link is, like, inches away from his face, like... Just on the edge of the bed, breathing into his face, staring. And then Nerva crawls over, looks, opens his eyes, sees him. He doesn't move. He just... And then he bounces away in glee after he scares you. To be fair, he wakes me up out of nightmares, and sometimes, I think... I'm low key pretty sure he like if I've uh, I, that he he I was hoping I would have something in it. <laughs> he are you a good boy? I know. What was that? What was that? Link, stop! <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> Did you guys hear the voice? I'm, I'm putting him bigger so you guys can see him being such a maniac. Did you guys hear the voice whispering? I don't, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know where I'm going. Link. You're creeping me out. You're 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 creeping me out just a little bit. He keeps leaning closer. He's like over. He's like over the, my lap. Is he 
Is he comforting me? Oh, but anyway, the day that I took him for his birthday, I I had repeatedly told you guys about our plans. And the day, the next day, when we woke up, he woke me up like, "Mom, it's time to go." It was like eight, eight like nine o'clock. He got up, and like the whole day, he was like bouncing around, like hyped. He was he was hyped for for going out. He knew. He made the voice. God damn. Place needs a massive deep clean. Yeah, somebody diarrhea all over the the place. It's unfortunate. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know where I'm heading at this point. I'm just wandering. Um, you know, uh, you know, you know. Do you guys give a voice to your dog? Like, do do you guys have a pet? What do you think your pet sounds like? So, like Linker Poof. His that he is. Um, am I talking about you? I'm sorry. I said your name. Um, so he, he's a Siberian husky, right? So I always give, I, I think he's like a Siberian. He's like, oi. What? He's like, I see cheeks. Do I see the cheeks? Keeps auto-aiming down. Maybe I can't shoot through the wall. <laughs> he's like, got the Siberian accent, you know? Ah! Oi! <laughs> I know I died! I wasn't- I thought it was dead! You were no help! Why didn't you heal me? <laughs> but he's like- he's like Siberian, you know- you know what I mean? Died of cringe. <laughs> like, I imagine he's like... Oh, I am- I am Siberian Husky. I have come here to get launch codes to missiles. I ended up somehow in this woman's house. She calls me a poopa. What even is a poopa? I like vodka. I am Siberian ex. I am Siberian husky. Blunt force trauma. And now it's shit on me, and I'm going to die. Time to use a syringe. I forgot I had one. Did we have one last time? Is that what you were trying to tell me? Oh my god. Did I not notice it this whole time? I'm sorry. I thought that we already had it. I thought we'd use this orange. I guess not. Do you know where the rest of the parts are? Do you remember what we did before the save? I know. She calls me a poopa. What even is a poopa? <laughs> I hate that. Hate everything about that. So he has Siberian husky accent. I know that my accent's not that good, but you just see, you, you get the point. Anyway, so I always, I always give him that voice. Chat, what voice do you give your, your pets? How did I never notice that the first time? <laughs> I never noticed there was a mannequin there. That's so funny. Wait, it actually says you died like Dark Souls? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Died of cringe from my... My Siberian accent. Huyo! Huyo! One, two, three, dodge. One, two, three. Uh, I was greedy. It's scissors. It's guitars on floor. With its... Its platform heels. Maybe you talk like it. <laughs> Dude, this sort of reminds me of a YouTuber. I imagine my cat's voice is just tired of my crap. I give him a lot of hugs and kisses and the most- Oh yeah. I give- I like to smooch him and he likes- Linkerpool believes that a kiss is not a kiss unless it's obnoxiously loud. So you have to- You gotta give him all the smooches. Like if- if it's not an audible kiss, then it's not a kiss to Linkerpool. You know what I mean? It's very important. Very important. Or he's like, 
Mama, we going poopies? A boop, 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 boop. Like. There was an anime with a cat with a Russian accent. See, I just imagine Link is out here being the the dashing debonair. He is with this thick ass accent and I love it. Is there like a bug or something? Can we go in? Big cam of a cat, please. Is dog. He's dog. Although he just left, he's trolling now. He's hardcore trolling. You, these lights jump scares. The Godfather voice, yeah. Who quit? She was super funny. She had three dogs and made the exact voice for one of them. See, Siberian husky. I have come here to steal all of your head pants. Even though you call me a poopa, at least I get all the turtle beetles. I can approve of this. Okay, this time, Linker Poo, I'm not gonna fuck up. Two. I missed. Oh! There was two! You tried to tell me. You tried to tell me, and I didn't listen. You're right, there was two. He's hiding. Me, hi, tiny mighty mouse, hello. Oh, other piece that I was missing. I believe that it looks like I need another one. How unfortunate. <sighs> Silly doggy. <sighs> Unless that's it. Oh, no, I did only need two. Good. That is gross, though. Very nice. Very nice. Very gross. <laughs> Siberian husky. Linker poo, are you Siberian husky? Do you go a woo? A woo woo? Yes. Tried to kiss me, went all over my face, bruh. They do be like that. You just have to, and, and, and you go with it. You just have to accept the kisses, okay? That's just the doggo way. You can't, you can't deny them all those, those good smoochers. You know? Thank you for the follow! Welcome to the Poopa Squad! The goose that uh, knows something true. The goose do be knowing something. Is it need to uh, go in a like ah? Uh... I think I broke it. Whoops! We got a key! I swear to God, if you jump scare me again, we're gonna have problems. No chewy stick for you when we go to bed if you jump scare me. Okay, maybe maybe you get one. Maybe just not two. Okay, you can have as many as you want. I'm a sucker. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you're talking about Jenna Marbles? <laughs> Wait, did she give one of her dogs that accent? Oh, okay, that's so funny. I never really watched her, but <gasps> the whole story is tragic. Her dogs are cute though. She has those weird skinny noodle looking dogs I was I was flattered but I rejected <laughs> dude I let my dog kiss me all over and I I don't even care I don't know what these like things of like I like it's like you're supposed to notice it and then you stop and stare at it but nothing happens I'm always like huh hey? Linkar Pool, did you decide you are bored of me because you got no more food? He says, Mommy, I need some water because all of these brittle beetles has made me thirsty. <laughs> nah, he deserves a treat for the jump scares. <sighs> Maybe. Maybe you're right. Always oh, back. I see him out the corner of my eye. Creeping as he does. You know how he do. Hi, Splitfire, though. How you doing? Yo, leave your sissy alone. I hear you snor <laughs> snoring. At you are causing problems, both of you. They like... They like the... They like... <laughs> they're liking the, 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 the jump scares and my my screaming energy a little too much. It makes them all riled up. <laughs> oh, God. Um, hi though, Lion, hello, how are you doing? 
It's okay. Um, after I ate, I feel a little better. Dash, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Poopoo Squad. It's still like three quarters there, you know? But it's tolerable. Most of the stream, though, has just been just chatting because I'm, I am I can't pay attention to everything, anything. And my dogs are crazy. But, you know, there's a... Oh, it's... It's you. Hello? Yeah. I can finally eat my baked potato in peace. I'm James. I'm James. Angela, man of your dreams. Angela. Okay. How do you do? Look, I'm not sure what you're planning, but there's always another way. Mm. Really? What's the point? It's easier just to run. Maybe it's all we deserve. Hello? We. Me. You. We are all the same. I'm not like you. Angel, it's a good split fire. Oh, you're so nice, Lynn. Thank you. Are you afraid? No. Wee, 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 wee. Sorry. Oh. There, more, all the oohs for you. Okay. Did you find your mother? No. Not yet. Did she live here? In this building? You gonna hydrate? No. So all you know is that she lived in this town? The audio is so shocking. What did you say? How did you know that? It was a it was a pretty easy inference. I just figured because this is where you're looking for her. How else would I know? Yeah. She's weird. <sighs> Sorry. Usually Linker Poo is really picky, but he's a garbage gut today. He's like, I'll eat baked potato. I'll eat this. I'll eat that. Did you find person that you were looking for? Not yet. He's been enjoying his steak tax. Her name's Mary. She's my wife. <laughs> I'm sorry. Ow! Oh, it's okay. I don't know why I think she's They're here. She... Doggy emotes. Oh my God. Hi. she died three years ago. Oh, the audio anomaly is happening again. Sorry, guys. She's dead? Oh, don't worry, I'm not crazy. At least He's I don't think so. He's stealing the steak tax and big potato tax. I have to find my mama. Uh, should I go with you? This town really is dangerous. Now I know what you meant back there in the cemetery. No, it's okay. I... Besides, I'd just slow you down. What, what, what about that? I... Thank you. Will you hold it for me? What? Sure. No problem. <laughs> yeah, I'll hold if on I kept to your... it. I'm not sure what I might do. No! What? I'm sorry. Oh my God, she's crazy. I'm Please don't. What? <laughs> well, okay. Dude, you better stay clear of that crazy. She's gonna stabby stab. Oh, she did leave the knife. Oy, she's she's a red flag walking. <laughs> I don't know 
if this is is worth it. Hi, love. Hello. Hello. How's your birthday week been good, Muffin? He just had his 10-year birthday on the 6th. And we had... It's been a nice puppy week, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it has. Yes, it has. Oh, my God. Big real-time mirror. Interesting. Look at that. How much for the day? You can't have him. He's all mine. Oh, he's mine. There's two in here, actually. Baby Zora's lurking around the corner somewhere. But the, you better watch out. He'll steal all your cheese and your steak and your baked potato. Okay, he... he you know, he pretends like he is, um... Aw, the poor teddy bear. He pretends he's picky until then he decides to eat all of your waffles. Even though he doesn't like waffles. That's the kind of boy he is. <laughs> He like he's the pickiest dog I've ever had. He turns his nose up at like everything and inspects it in case like you poisoned it. And then I when we were giving him pills, he like now refuses to eat hot dogs or any sausages or like round meat because he's concerned that I put I I poisoned him. <laughs> You guys have missed out. He's been jump scaring me. His favorite pastime hobby. Thank you guys so much for all hanging out. Mutton, hello. Thank you for stopping by, Lion. You guys are so... S the vibrations are not cool. I'm just saying that. You guys are... S it feels like it's coming from that way. I feel like I should hide. I don't know. I don't like that. <laughs> I need to go that way, though. I don't like that one bit. He's been, um... He's been such a little cute. Are you licking your toots? Leave your toots alone. <laughs> he see, likes to, his favorite pastime hobby is jump scaring me. On and off stream. I'll have you know. Oh, arm tattoos? I got a few. I have six tattoos. There's a Twitch. Jeff, septic high, PMA. Positive mental attitude. Need that shit to slap me in the face every day because I'm a pessimistic at heart. You guys wouldn't believe me, though. By my content. I'm that dumb, that dummy who has visible tattoos at a young age, you know? My second tattoo I ever got was on my hand. I have a cross on my hand, on the other hand. And then I've got a Naraka Soul Bloom tattoo. Have a Mizu tattoo. And then another Mizu tattoo. That pre-existed Mizu though. The logo below my VTuber on the bottom right. Interesting. This is the the second uh, piano music we found. I wonder if that's like an Easter egg that means something to someone who's smarter than me. <laughs> this definitely gives me like disturbing uh, like levels of like like similar to like Outlast. You know, like could we have? Oh wait a that. That transition makes no sense, does it? Maybe it does. That was like... Yeah, it might. It might. Okay, I was thinking we were dealing with like a... What's, what's, the, what's the one where you're painting and you're going crazy? And when the door closes, sometimes stuff changes. <laughs> The word pagan is mostly derived from is is kind of an ambiguous term because pagan refers to anything that's not the religion of the king at the time or the royalty fun facts with me so, so paganism could have been any religion that wasn't whoever the royalty at the time was oh dear god Whew. whoopsies 
the cheese tax, the cheese tax, the cheese tax. I'll have you know I sing that every day to him. We eat cheese before bed almost every night. And, and, and I sing it almost every time. Hi, Maker, hello. Linker Poo didn't even flinch when Mizu screamed. <laughs> Dude, the visceral, or the visceral screech of like sound piercing Mizu screams and he's like, yeah, man, if I had a nickel. <laughs> Did he not even move? See, he's a, dude, he's just, and he's not deaf by any means, I'll have you know, so. I swear those move. Save station, gotta love my save station. Finally making some progress after just chatting for two and a half hours of this stream. Okay. <sighs> Wait. No, I didn't change it. Oh, yeah. I mean, it looks right. I'm scared. We're saving again. <laughs> We're saving again. Boo! Ah! Your poo's just like, I'm chill, bro. Hi, I'm doing okay. How are you? Still got the migraine from hell, but it is okay. Oh, this room, I believe it was not openable before. And then there's nothing, never mind. What in the poop? Uh? Linker poop, what am I supposed what do you think? What am I supposed to do? What do you think? Where where is your your cupcake you squished on my carpet? Did you eat it? Hmm. He says he does not know. You don't know? Are you certain? Okay. He says he doesn't know, chat. He doesn't know. How does Zora like the cupcake? Oh, yeah, she devoured it. I Did I not send you a video of that one? I sent you videos, but I might have missed the Zora reaction. I recorded it. <laughs> Your Mexican accent is good? Is that a Mexican accent? <laughs> Why, thank you. It is my Siberian husky accent. Chat, did I finish the puzzle? I didn't watch them, that is okay. Did you see my knocking fridge? It boopa scoopas when you touch it. It also interacts and lights up when Linker Pooh's butt walks by. It is very strange. Silly Hill 2 story is fucked. Even the meaning behind the enemies. Bro! Backseat me, please, and thank you. Walk me through everything. I don't know what's going on. Help. Uh. <laughs> I don't know. Did I not finish the clock? It can't interact with the clock again, so I, I feel like I certainly finished it. This is the remake. But yeah, I'm confused because I thought I did it. Does this unlock Scott's room? Is that the point? Is it there, but there's like not an S room. I see H and M. Oh wait, on the first pl floor there's an S on the door. Okay, I lied. I figured it out. All right. 
how do we go down again? Um. Ah, uh, okay. Is it down over there? Or is it over here? God damn it, my memory is failing me today. You know? Two or three endings? Oh, man. Well, you know damn well I'm not gonna get the good one. I saw the fridge. Good, good, good. What do you think of my fridge? Isn't it cute? <laughs> This is not the correct down either. Where? Uh, I can't tell by the map. What was it? Let's go to the first floor and see where we came up from. Chat, I'm sorry. I just didn't. I usually have a decent sense of, of direction, but I'm. I'm struggling with my recall of where we're supposed to go. Okay, we need to go back to the save station out and then just into the doorway. Okay, it's very simple. I'm making it harder. My bad, chat. What other voices do I deal? Well, chat likes to make me do mommy voice. We used to call it ASMR voice. But chat believed that it wasn't very ASMR, so we renamed it. And then I can do chibi voice too, depending on how warmed up my voice is for the day. It depends on a lot of things, you know? You know, um, depends on how capable I am of doing those voices. I can go even higher up if I really want to, but this one is the most comfortable to sit in. And then, um, when I'm less tired and haven't been screaming my head off, chat makes me do, uh, um, Yondere, which goes a little... <laughs> Welcome to the stream. I hope you've been enjoying your time with me. And then lately, uh, chat's been making... Excuse me! Yeah. What do you mean the door didn't open? Is that not the Scott door? What was the point of the clock? I'm stumped, chat. Tell me what do I need to do. Clock against someone sitting somewhere. I think there's two or three innings. Halt in the name of anime law. <laughs> Hi, heroin. Hello. I thought for sure it'd open it because it says Scott. Aw, oh, man. Now I'm just disappointed. I feel like there wasn't that much on the first floor. Chat, what did I miss? They missed like a small little... Where's 111? Oh, it's this door. Well, that's not an open to build door, so. Ugh, what do I do? I need help. Having solved the last clock related puzzle, the door, double door jams has marked S, the door on floor phone. You can also enter the smaller room in the area with the clock to attain a strange photo. It doesn't open! I just, but I can't interact with the clock again! Uh, did I, what if? I would assume if I can't interact with the clock again, I did, succeeded at the puzzle. What the fuck? And I got the, I got the photo. What gives? Grady, I break everything I touch. Somebody help me. Dude, my, at least I, I was on to the right thing, but... 
Still confused. Still lost in the sauce. And still fucking stupid. <laughs> oh man, your dog looks content with life, I'm glad. Aww. Are you looking at the camera? I don't think he's looking at me, I think he's staring at the camera. I thought he was looking at me like that. He's like, no, bitch, I don't look at you like that. I look at the camera. <laughs> oh my god, he is! He's totally looking at the camera. Okay, I was itching my nose. He's looking at me now, but. What? So here's the clock. Can't interact with it again. It's set to 9, uh, 10? On your way down to the door on the first, when you reach the top of the stairwell on floor two. I went the wrong way. Because I am dumb. Dude, that door is so hard to see. Corpse. There's no corpse here. I mean, I killed the thing down here. I keep getting stuck in this game. Well, there's surely... See, what I'm confused about that makes no sense to me is just... The, the door... <laughs> we did this. You find that you have f f have to find the door. I did. It won't open. It's downstairs. Got a big S carved into it. I don't freaking understand what I'm doing wrong. Do I need to reload my game? So look, I did the clock. Was the clock right? Did I do the wrong time and like hard lock myself or something? You can go here. There's a gross sounding door. Then we go through this stupid gross room. Take it around town. Then we go through these double doors. And then we take a left. And there's the S door. What am I doing wrong? What do you guys think I'm doing wrong? Why does this keep happening to me? So much for progressing. We were doing so good. But what's the point? The clock says 9.10. Did I fuck that up? That's correct. Is there like a, like a glitch? I would like hard like lock myself somehow. I already said it. Oh. I need the second. Well, I couldn't do this before. Where do you get the second? I couldn't even interact with the clock, so maybe there was like a glitch? Do you get the second? 
is that now am I maybe maybe I was like glitched. What do we think? Yeah, because now you can go in here. Can open that. Where was the did I already get the Polaroid? Yeah, you need the second? Okay. Where do you get that that there's a note for it? Okay. Well, I couldn't even like add, like mess with the clock again, so that makes more sense. So it seems like it was like Henry fears Scott. He'll run from him and hide. He flees on the west to the other side of here. Mildred, unknown, is face down behind her descent. Face down for it, but I don't have this. Okay, I already got the Polaroid. Two oh eight. Can I go to Scott's room now or no? I need something else. I think it was, I think I fucking glitched it and what, that's what happened. Oh, fuck. Where is the, where did, what did I, do I need to go to 208 for? to eat but yes cassie thank you for hanging out i appreciate you tons thank you have a wonderful eat i don't where's the note that i'm supposed to have for the second well, at least we know, because, like, I couldn't even interact with the clock again after... Oh, well, I can't do it again now. So it's, like, completely unaware. The thing you read, including the second? But where do I get... I don't have the hand for the second. So I need to... I don't know where it is. I don't know what I possibly could have missed. Gotta find it? You're not out. <laughs> I can give you the, the, your room to start out. Okay, yeah. Because I feel like I explored everywhere. All the back seating. Now I'm stuck. Okay. Cause I can't open the other, like the H and the M door. So it's like, do I do, is the, do I need to go to M? Is that what the, is that the thing? Oh God. That's my bad. I thought I ran past it and it still wouldn't open. So weird. I feel like the, the irritation with that is like, it's never opened. So like, I don't see why what told me it opens now. Do you know what I mean? Nice. Another freaking glory hole. Okay. Puzzles. But there's nothing that tells you that's like, like the H door just randomly opened, I guess. Moon dot skull dot dot skull. Ugh, this would drive me nuts. I would be really disturbed by the moths. Ew, it's a big one. Are the dots the moths? 
That's the moon moth. Okay. So are there any others? Those are the dots and then the moon. When you put the minute hand and the clock that and mm, that's my bad, I'm dumb. It's one of each here. Hmm. I guess. Could glory holes tell you there's another room? Helping Karate. I really appreciate you. Okay. Skull. Moon. What I I'm hoping the it's the moths in total, not how many are are on their wings. That just leaves a lot. So there's skull, moon. Was there another one in here? Or no? No, okay. Skull Moon. I think I'm overcomplicating it. I think it's pretty simple. Skull Moon. So the skulls <sighs> is two. There's only two skulls so far. Oh. <laughs> two skulls. There's one. Two, three moons, and then one, two, er. Three dots? The both three? I think it's two, three, three. Am I right? One, two, three. One, two, three. Unless. Yeah. Okay. Uh, moon minus dot is zero, which doesn't make sense. Um. Or is it supposed to be how many dots are depicted on them? Is that actually one? So that's four. Does this count as five then? Because there's only one on that wing. So five, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, okay. So then it's eight minus five is three. Two plus five is seven. And five minus two is three again. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Karate. Thanks for keeping track. Okay, I wasn't I wasn't sure if it wanted me to count like wings, you know, and it was it guessing how many in totality. Oh, look at all the I've always thought mounting bugs was kind of gross. I actually, I do have a couple butterflies that are, were real butterflies and stuff, but I've always a little bit of it as, I mean, they're beautiful, like for scientific reasons, but just for funsies, I, I've always found it a little gross. Why are there so many glory holes in this game? It makes me a little disturbed. I wondered how he put that the the hit the flashlight on him. That's cute. It's just in his pocket. Ah. Okay. Are you letting me out now? <gasps> I just noticed the craziest thing. I just noticed the craziest thing. So the controller 
has regional vibration. I've never noticed this about my PS5 controller. I, d with headphones, for whatever reason, I feel like I have really sensitive ears, but my d my sound direction isn't very good with, like, in games. Because, like, in real life, I'll, I can do, like, this to, like, double check. But, like, in games, I tend to be, like, a little bit off on directional sound. I was trying to figure out where that vibration was coming from, and I moved to listen for my my character for myself and it it across my controller it was vibrating like both sides then it went all the way to the right and then all the way to the left so i never noticed that that's crazy uh i gotta get my hair recolored in the morning so ah, well, you'll be, I, Lola, by the way hope you have the happiest birthday sending you all the love I think that's what I heard. Yay. Were those gashes on the wall there before? Dude, those mannequins keep staring. This room was nice before. Oh. Looky. Oh. How the time flies. Okay. Anyway, have a wonderful hair coloring. Sending lots of love. Sending lots of love. Also, your emotes. Uh, I can't wait to see your your emotes when you get them and stuff. Uh, definitely send pics. Okay. I I love you, and I hope you had a wonderful birthday. And you're the cutest patootie ever. And I I hope you you are doing well. Okay. Yeah, now this room is gross. Be it wasn't before. It's like whatever comes through just like rots everything and rusts everything. I don't think Xbox controllers do that. Got that? I don't know. Yeah, dude. I just it's unless I'm crazy. Let's see. Um, can or like how does or what all does PS5 controller? vibration do <laughs> ps5 controller vibration also known as haptic fever provides more so it has dynamic vibrations controller dual and actuators can simulate a range of sensations from the recoil of weapons to feeling of, of different environments adaptive triggers which is crazy i really noticed this one audio based haptic feedback when headphones are plugged into the controller's auto audio jack the controller can provide haptic vibrations based on the game's audio and dude it doesn't even but yeah there it definitely goes like i noticed it that's crazy it, it does i've never heard anyone talk about it but it totally happened Unless it was my brain making it up because of the sound and, like, doing that. Because you know how your brain, like, can fake things because it believes something? But, yeah. <laughs> Good night. No, don't worry. Please, go rest. Thank you so much for all the love, Jerry, and all the fun. Mwah! Hugs. Thanks for hanging out while we talk the tea all day. <laughs> um, after the... Okay. Henry fears Scott. He'll run from him and hide. He's fled to the west. So to the left. To the other side. But here comes Mildred with unknown intent. Scott lies face down. Blind to her descent. Henry West, Mildred, descent. Henry West. That's why I thought it was down. Is it the opposite of... Okay. The opposite of the West. Gotcha. Yeah, you can feel the humming of that bell. And as it resonated and got quieter, the controller was like, Doo. 
I, yeah, I, you know, it'd be really interesting to have haptics to to have uh, viewers experience streams the same way, and like they, if they held the controller, they got to feel it too. You could plug in something and and get the the same thing. Okay, after the clock, make sure you get the thing on the stairs because it only happens after the clock is solved. Okay. The stairs going down, yeah? Ooh, yeah, this was not here before. Crotty, thank you. Oh. Yeah, what do these do? What do these do? Like, what's the point of, like, what are these, like, stills? Because we get them all the time and I have no idea what it means. Is that part of, like, endings? It's just a flesh mech, yeah. I always like to say as well, like if you think about it, aren't VTubers just like, if you think about it, are, aren't f like VTubers just the, uh, this was closed off and I had the maze before, but now this has been drugged through. Nice. VTubers are just face puppets, man. You know what I mean? Top of the set. Was that right, Karate? Was that right? Or was that not right? Oh my god! I'm gonna be honest, I don't know anything about the lore with it. What? 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 No! Well, no, this is the thing after. Oh, so I fucked up. Too late, I suppose. I thought that that was the stairwell you meant. It was that body that I stared at. Oh, well, I guess. Really? I've seen a playthrough of, like, all of them at some point, but it's been so long I totes don't remember. Besides, like, it existing. There's a boss fight? My god. I don't think you can kill Pyramid Head. So I'm like, what? Um, I'll, uh, we're, we'll pause for the... For the, um... For the ad break. Mm. Well, at least we're getting somewhere. Thank you guys for hanging out. Hi. How's it going? I have to fight Pyramid Head. It's scary. What you watching? Alien. You're watching Alien? Yeah. What's wrong with you? Is it the new one or the like OG I'm one? Binging them all. You're binging them all? Why? Because they're good. What's wrong with you? I've actually never seen one. Yeah, hard pass, hard pass. Yeah. They look, ew! It looks like the same era that like the original Jurassic Park came out of. That's like the vibe I get. Oh. Yeah, that's gross, Nerva. I don't want to look at that. Mm. Sorry, I'm stretching my neck. Hi, Parla. We're about to do a boss fight, and there's an ad playing, so. We're waiting for the ad to get over. We're about to fight Pyramid Head. Hello! Hi! How are you doing? Thanks for hanging out. Sorry, chat. Today, I've been just chatting for, like, so much of the day about random stuff. Thank you all for hanging out. Nonetheless. Ugh. I have a harder time, like, paying attention and staying on topic and, like, problem solving and, like, puzzle solving. When I have a migraine, so I appreciate you all. Also, I took my meds today, which always make me a little drunk. Pretty much until the next day. I'm just, like, a little off. All right, 10 seconds! Okay. 
Thank you guys for watching the ad. We paused it so you guys didn't miss anything. I appreciate you. It really does help when you guys do watch them um, because it helps me be a full-time content creator and everything. And, and yeah, so thank you so much. Mwah! Mwah! You're extremely kind. I'm trying to when we at least like, I feel like if it's like a Naraka game, nothing you can do, right? If it's, if, if it's a story game, it feels like the need to, if it's like kind of humdrum, like we're just playing like card sim or whatever, like it doesn't super matter, but like for, for things that are people are like wanting to watch it, there's no reason why we can't. So we actually swapped it to three minutes every hour instead of a minute and a half every half hour, which gets rid of pre-roll so we can at least time the ads, you know? Um, just because it seems like it's easier to take a break. If I could do like six minutes every two hours, that would be even easier. We'd all just, I'd be like, okay, it's snack break time. We're all taking poops. It's probably good too, to like force myself to take breaks. Like, you know, I, sh I, I should definitely just get in the habit where like, I try to take a break once an hour because like most content creators can like willy nilly like leave and they have like a BRB on their screen and stuff. But like I never do that. I'm always like sprinting to pee or whatever. I feel like it's healthy. I should do that more. So it's like a great excuse for us to like chill, pet my dogs, drink some water, stretch, if, uh, go take a poop, you know? I feel like that's smart. I I forget, who was it the other day who said that? They were like, yeah, I for it forces me to like actually take a break. And I'm like, that's probably really healthy. <laughs> okay, let's do it! Oh. So what am I supposed to do? Cause I'm assuming, I, it kind of seems like I can't hit him. I'm kind of under the impression that like he is invincible. Maybe he's not? Oh, do I want him to destroy stuff? Is it like uh, I have to wait time? What happens if I hit him in the head? It just ricochet? Okay, okay, wait. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> I should go back and watch Lena play this and see what her reaction is during this fight because I bet she's freaking out. Whew, okay. At least we get to restart here. That's nice. Yeah, I'm curious. Oh, hello. Thing. I don't feel like I've done anything to him. It feels like about the same time passed. Oh, fuck! Daddy. Papa, Papa Poots over here. Oh my god! The iframes of Dodge! How wonderful they are! No! My first time was better than this. Let's just restart. Is it? 
Is it just a timing thing? It really feels like I just have to survive long enough. Spent half the time calling in Betty and the other half figuring out what to do. Uh, sounds about right. Sounds about, sounds about what's going on here. Ah! Sorry. I was trying to loot. Sir. Does he need to just destroy stuff? Like I can't, I can't tell. I keep trying to heal and I'm failing. Yeah, maybe I need him to ruin stuff. Maybe, maybe that's what it is. Time and destroying things. Let's see if he'll ruin this box. Okay. You want to hit this? Come on. He's got a nice cleaver to him, you know? Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, it just seems like time. I didn't even hit him, you know? I, I He seems invincible, and I need... Oh, he's faster now. He seems invincible, and, uh, like, the... in the He's just gonna have to... That we're just gonna have to wait it out. That's what it seems like. dodge yeah it seems like it's it's time based if I'm being honest with you we'll, we'll hit him with the opening I just need to honestly say ah oh, shit Probably a bad idea, but here we go. Okay, something's happening. It is time based. reset him he just doesn't care now he's so fucking strong he has such an odd walk or something's coming and he's like I don't have time for this shit that might be it. I mean, the alarm doesn't sound good by any means. Oh, it stopped. Okay. Dude, it was 100% time-based. What do they mean, keep shooting it? That's what I felt. I felt like they were very similar in how long it took both times. And one time I hit him a lot and one time I didn't. There's no way it's not time-based. It's survival because you can't kill him. So it's a waste. Ah! <laughs> Me is you smart! Me is you smart! Yeah! 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 Why can't I get it? There we go. IGN, don't. Too distracted by abs. <laughs> Me's a clear-minded. 
clear minded poop. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm just getting all the trophies. I still think it's funny, the one of, like, trying to open too many doors for no reason. Dude, we should just end back to where we are, so I guess we left. It's interesting. Why the, the, I guess he had other things to do with the siren. See, I am going to be a fucking loot goblin because... Oh, see? Because uh, this game has no fucking heals in it, okay? It's, like, so bad to the point where it's, like, tempting to, like, reload that boss fight just to, like, intentionally not get hit. Okay. There is a child. I saw them. At least we're making progress. I did a whole chapter today, even though I like was being a potato. Look at her drawings, they're so cute. Hey. Oh my God. It was you, wasn't it? You're the one who stepped on my hand. Hmm, <laughs> maybe I did. <laughs> What's a little girl like you doing here anyway? I don't know. What's a big dum-dum like you doing here anyway? Hey, What's that's wrong not with very her? nice. Didn't your parents teach you Who hurt you? Since he's just being a potato, we'll shrink it a little bit. So it's what you got there? You guys can enjoy None of your eats. business. You didn't love Mary anyway. <gasps> hey, wait. What is that? His How daughter or some baby? shit? That was weird. Bruh. Don't act like you can't parkour up there. If she can, you can. Come on, James. So, question. As to the fact that I haven't played the first game. Or any of the games. Um. Y'all got any, like, like a, is this standalone enough that I can just be oblivious? <laughs> wow. Wow. Have you guys seen people who have modded this game and and without uh to see it without um fog? It's fucking beautiful. It's absolutely incredible how good this game also You know what's really uh really imp again I'm playing this on the PlayStation so I can't speak to the PC port. The amount of foliage in the out overgrown fully in the outside without noticing any frame loss and how like thick it is i mean still just like everything they're just flat you know pngs but there's a there's a lot of poly going on in here i mean it's it's quite impressive from like a game standpoint and um i don't know if the fog is used as a, as a loading screen, you know, and that we don't get to see and that it saves on resources when it's there. But it definitely is is impressive. To say the least. I, I It's very pretty. About the first game? Uh, I don't know the lore. So it's like, is this game standalone? I get plenty of information by not have playing the game or do you guys need to lore explain me the t you know what i mean if you guys haven't seen it look on twitter or whatever that's where i saw it but uh uh check out um oh this is really cool i love the ads for like real places in the game that we went past Pete's, Bolorama, Neely's, Girls' Night every weekend, Silent Hill is historic, historical uh, society, Boat, Tripody, Jack's in, like, all of these are places, like, actually on the map and stuff. Welcome to Silent Hill, a quiet little lakeside resort town. We're happy to have you. 
There's no better place than here to let go of your busy schedule and finally enjoy a relaxing vacation. Rose are quaint, rustic houses mark a gorgeous mountain landscape, and as the dawn turns to dust, the surface of Toluca Lake shines a whole range of dreamlike colors. Silent Hill will move you and fill your heart with peace. We're more than certain your time here will be pleasant and leave you with memories that will stay forever. Average city in Montana. You're right, you're right. Yo, if you guys are ever in Montana, go to Phillipsburg. It's not like it's something that you have to really spend more than one day at. Um... I always take day trips and they're, you know, they close fairly early. They're not open on Saturdays because they're like, what's the religion? That, that is like Saturdays and stuff. The whole town does that, but it's, it's cool. They got like a candy shop and some cute little things. And they're, um, at the base of like the, a big sapphire mine and you can do sapphire mining. It's pretty cool. Pa Patrick Chester, son of Edward, he fought and died for the people, for liberty, and for all our tomorrows. His memory lives on. Both the horse and him with no head. Loot. Loot, 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 loot. Okay, I can't, I'm not maxed out on ammo. I lied because I have 30 now. Still pay salute. Mm, we can't really see where we've gone. Sorry, I'm like tracing my steps, making sure I've looked everywhere. Okay, this is where we started. Gotcha. The first thing that came out of Googling Phillipsburg was a city in New Jersey. Phillipsburg, Montana. It's at the base of... Um, God, what's the ski resort called? There's a ski resort. Not too far away. And um, there's... There's a famous sapphire mine. Oh, God, we're on the pier. Ugh, hate it. I hate being on docks. I hate overlooking water. Dude, everything's headless. Why? It's a symbolic. The memory of 67 who died of illness now sleep beneath the lake. What? Coffee to go. Gimme, 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 gimme. Also, another small town that I like, if you guys uh, are in the Washington area, of course, everybody should go to, um, naturally, everybody should 100% visit uh, Leavenworth at some point. The, the uh, like... What is it? Germantown? That one's super fun. It's not as cool as it used to be, but it's definitely, if you've never been to something like that, pretty cool. Um, and, but one of my favorite places is Paul's Bell. It's a Viking, like, themed town. And they have dog days, and everybody has dogs and, like, takes them everywhere, and the dogs are, the shops are dog friendly. And they got pretty good food. Uh, what's that other one? North of uh, where they hold the Tulip Festival up north. I'm trying to think. I don't travel much, so. Oh my god. Scary! Mm, hello? Mary? How about both nerve damage? Yo, she got pink hair! Me too vibes! No. You're... not. She got tattooed. You look like your girlfriend. What? No, my... Wait, wife. Face, your voice, you could be my there. name is Maria. Oh my god, weird. I don't look like a ghost, do I? <laughs> She's flirting with us, too. Don't yeah. touch me. Sorry, I got confused. 
Good for you. Where are you going? I need to find Mary. You tell her. Didn't you say she died? Huh? Yeah. Three years ago. It's it's just... I got a letter from her. A letter? I know how it sounds. I'm, I'm not... I don't... Hey. It's okay. So, what did the letter say? She said she was waiting for me in our special place. And that's here? Anyway, I haven't seen her. It's so weird. Is this your only special place? I, uh... I don't know anymore. something I just I can't quite hey I think I might know I mean there's this one place not far from here this is weird T what kind of place the kind two lovers might call special <laughs> what does that I'm supposed to mean don't get close. Unless you have somewhere else to be. Don't touch Something him! To do. What? What? <laughs> Easy there. Dude. I'm just messing with you. I hate I hate people who do that shit. I don't mm. I'm not a touchy person. It's this way. Don't touch me. You're coming with me? That makes me so uncomfortable. Sorry. Can't you just tell me where it is? You're just going to leave me here? How'd you get here to be here? I don't fucking know you. With all these monsters around? No, I, I just... Dude, she's a gaslighting queen. I remind you of her. No, it's just, I don't know you. you. Loved her, didn't why you? you're here and why now I'm responsible for you. Like you're a lost puppy. Didn't you? All right, just... So it's okay. Yeah. She gives me red flag vibes. Red flag, red flag, red flag. Sus, don't touch me. Man. I'm definitely the kind of person who, as well, I feel like. She's wearing a red flag. Dude, she uh, uncanny mood. <laughs> Come on. Well, the most ironic thing is Nerva and I had the conversation last night about uncanny and the definition of it and why it's weird. Like, oh yeah, the physics though on her outfit are kind of kind of nice, her hair and stuff. But uh, of course, she's leading us so we can stare at her ass. Okay, any, okay, any, how many girls are in my chat right now? I don't know if there's very many besides karate. Can I admit something? Can I, can I admit something? No, this is my first Silent Hill game. I gotta admit something. Chat. I am straight as a board. But, but, dude, I under I can kind of relate. I understand, like, being respectful, but, like, I can kind of relate to dudes because when people's, like, tits and ass are out, I cannot help but, like, notice them <laughs> as, as a straight woman, okay? I, I just feel like, I just feel like sharing that, okay? Okay, I can't, I can't help it. Some of these, like, big boobas are out. I'm like, whoop, oh, oh yeah. Like, I, they're meant to be noticed when, like... <laughs> like, thank you very much. Of course, like...
like if I have somebody who's like undressing me with their eyes, that's incredibly uncomfortable. That's just rude, you know? Anybody who stares you down, whether it's in an inappropriate or not manner, is is rude. Strangers staring you down, weird, 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 hate it. You look at someone, you make eye contact, they refuse to break the eye contact. Weird, weird. Same with my boobs. Ref- please break the eye contact with them. But as a straight woman and your your big kajungas are out and you contoured them and put glitter on them for like like shimmer, like I wouldn't notice, I, I do. I do. I, okay. And again, straight as a board. <laughs> Still notice. That lady's boobs. I still see them, okay? I'm not blind. So, um, yeah, I just... <sighs> Karate, do you see... Do you notice people's boobs? <laughs> like, right now. I still am noticing her butt. I'm trying... I'm looking respectfully. I'm sorry. Ma'am. Please stop touching here. me. And, and, uh, please walk behind me, okay? I shall lead the way and open the door for you, my lady. Are you coming? I have a gentleman. Nah. She got that butterfly tat. She don't, she don't need. She's into different kinds of boys. She into them bad boys. Bad boys, bad boys. What you, yo, would you like some ice cream? Since we're out on a date now? No. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, King Sir Doc, hi, I'm sorry you came at a weird time. I, I, I suppose, true. See, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm, I'm just saying. Of course, I'm not trying to be weird about it. But like, also, sometimes, there's one with like, tastefully, like, you look good. You look good. But sometimes, they got the kajongas out. And I'm like, whoa! <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm part of the itty bitty titty committee. I never, I, I, I can't relate. So it's impressive when I see them. <laughs> oh, weird. They're all headless, but the child is not. Oh my god, wait. You just reminded me. Remember? Do you guys remember? Do you guys remember when I was telling you about the dude, the, the guy, there's a guy who makes content on TikTok and he's got his ick, his ick list. And, and, uh, so he watches other people's, uh, he watches other people's content and then he, like, um, he like, he, he has a list of people's ridiculous icks. Uh, I, I, one f came up on my Twitter feed and, and I laughed so hard. Okay. It, it, sorry. Glitter crotch reminded me of this. Okay. Here you go. And here's a piece of advice. If you're a straight man at the airport, I want to see you in pants with some structural integrity. I don't want to see you in your comfies. That's not. At first, I'm not gonna lie, I thought she meant that somebody's wearing a little tight and a little too loose, like, you know what I mean? Like, the, like, like, they're, like, a little too tight of pants. Showing a little too much on the down under. But little, I was wrong. I was wrong. That's not at all what she meant by this. She is a psycho. And I'm pretty sure her hat says books. And, and, and I think that says a lot about her care. Oh, yeah, most of them definitely are rage bait. But the guy, literally, he just finds people's icks. But some people actually are just r really, like, like, one girl's like, I just can't stand when they, like, have a birthday. Like, you guys and remember, here's a anyway. Of advice. If you're a straight man at the airport, I want to see you in pants with some structural integrity. I don't want to see you in your comfies. That's not for you. I didn't sign up to leave the house and see you wearing joggers with a hole in it. Those things are for girls only. Please put on your jeans, khakis, J. Crew chinos. They're always on sale at the factory outlet. It's an epidemic and it's only getting worse. I've visited a lot of airports and it seems like as straight men, we're taking creative liberties that we don't need to be taking. Why do you need to be it's, it's, 
it's it's a sight for sore eyes. Don't be gumpy. You guys wear the pants in society, so wear the pants everywhere in the airport. And if you can't dress appropriately, as my girl Kamala Harris says, do not come. Do not come. I see. There's the list. This is the best part of it. Six hundred and forty-seven. Don't wear comfy, comfortable clothes. <laughs> uh, I just, I just, anyway, anyway, I just, I thought that was, that was just too good. I had to, I felt like I should show you guys that. I thought that one was pretty funny. <laughs> I don't know, man. It was pretty good. Oh, uh, me... And she? Want to take a breather? What? I uh, know. I just. Sorry, I'm just a bit. I feel like a, this is such an odd. Fine. You know. Me and if she. Anything you want to talk about? Anything? I feel like I would say me and her, not me no. and she. Let's just keep moving. Weird. I don't know why I find that so weird. Men can't really go out and find something decent enough to actually decide to sit down with them and make a life with them, especially with the amount of cheating and the amount of icks some people. Dude, it's it's the icks are crazy. I'm like, bro. You're like existing? How dare you? But yeah, no, I found that shit crazy. Crazy. Yo! Oh, chat, we got a pooper. Ah, uh, they're like, I don't want to disappoint you. You've had a lot of toilets. You've had a lot of toilets. Lady, you're following me a little close when I'm trying to go drop a duke. A deuce. Oh. Oh, no, we're going in the women's bathroom. Hello? A dookie. A dookie. <gasps> the toilet is blessed up! It doesn't flush, but it doesn't have to! We got a winner! Woo! Gifts from the pooper. Very nice. But yeah, I love that he just, like, makes content about the icks. It makes me laugh. It makes me laugh. This place we're going to, what is it exactly? It used to be kind of a special place for young couples in these parts. I think it's easier if I just show you. Mm. I don't like the way you worded that, ma'am. Uh, you, you know, I can't tell you to the, you know, the, the dark dungeon where I'm going to kidnap you, where I'm taking you is. You just, uh, you just have to, you just have to trust me. That's all. It's a, it's a secret location. You can't know anything about it. It's not sus. You're sus for thinking it's sus. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dude, I'm sorry. I'm like OCD explore looting because we are so low on mats all the time in this freaking game. That, like... I'm like, we have to touch every single inch of this game if we're gonna survive, okay? <laughs> Who is that? Just a woman. Killed for no real fault of her own by moral upstanding folk. Common theme, I guess. What do you mean? And history, you know? Is there like witch trials here? She was killed by the Christians, it said. Even though it's blurbed out. I think that, like, uh, you know what? Okay, how many... Okay, do you... Okay, here's another weird thing about... I've heard so many millennials and Gen Zers, like, make this comment recently. And I'm like, thank you! So... I think that bachelor at parties and bachelor parties are fucking weird. Like at least the way that pop culture explains them. I think they're so gross. Like, dude, why is that normal? Most people cheat on them. 
them or like like bang so like bang someone or do close enough to like make out touch people go do inappropriate things go to strip club like why what about the bachelor i think like oh do you mean the like the show yo that shit's wild too but <laughs> I, I i'm not gonna lie i'd be out here like I, I, I definitely, okay, I think that shit's weird too, but I also am guilty of watching it. <laughs> I don't have cable, so I don't do, but when I used to stay at my grandma's house, she always watched it, and my ass would be down there watching it with some popcorn, but no, I think it's really unhealthy, like, them dating all those people. I guess I'm very traditional in that sense, like, m morality wise. And I'm the kind of person who, I'm, like, clinging. Like, I'm all, like, all or nothing kind of person. And that shit makes me so weirded the fuck out. We didn't do parties like that. We just g got together, friends, and played board games. See, that's normal. Go do something fun. Have, like, a sleepover party. Like, I would do, like, childish stuff. That would be my favorite thing. Is, like, doing something, like, silly with friends or, like, like cute or like pam like go to a spa day or like dudes going out hunting or something I, I don't know like camping like I think that's cute also all my favorite things I'm always sad when my significant other isn't there because I'm like oh they would have loved this <laughs> like, I wish they were here too so like but I just the idea the idea of like how TV at least puts like Bachelor and Bachelor. It grosses ever since I was a little kid, too. I've always fucking thought that was the weirdest shit ever. Also, a ton of my like parents aged like friends when COVID hit and stuff were like getting divorced or like not doing well. And like most of them are like getting the age where they're retiring and they're like, oh yeah, we got to alternate our retirement because, you know, we can't stand to be around each other that much. I'm like, what the fuck? And those are like, so if you guys don't know, um, long story short, Nerva and I were in a long distance relationship for like three and a half years. And we met when I was 18 and he was 21. And so like all of those age, right? Grandpas and parents age people. Anytime that like, it was my relationship was like ever brought up by like older people it was like so freaking judged and then even after we moved in together still judged like it's like not realistic and we're living in like this la la and like one day we're gonna wake up and not be in the honeymoon phase it's been eight years <laughs> still still just as fine if not better than before but like like it's so weird but those are the and they're like that's not normal like you guys don't have normal jobs so like one day you're gonna have a house and like responsibilities and like there's gonna be issues and you guys are gonna fight over it and you're gonna realize you've been living in the honeymoon phase and i'm like well i'm chronically ill and sometimes like i pass out in the bathroom on the floor when i'm taking a shit and he witnesses it so like i don't i don't you know where's the <laughs> i'm always like i was like you know like where's the where's the line where like that's not a real relationship someone who like takes care of you in sickness and health but like people are like yo you spend too much time together that's unrealistic that's a bad relationship i hate my wife when we go on vacations we bring a another couple with us because we don't like spending that much time together. We gotta go do dude bro shit. Like, that, that, you're weird. You're the one with the bad relationship. Shut up. They're the judgmental ones, too, who are like, your relationship's weird and not right. Dude, <laughs> sounds based. Dude, I, my parents had a couple friends, and they, they, on their honeymoon, brought another couple because they don't like being around each other that long. I'm not joking. I'm like, what? <laughs> and and so many people yeah, just we can go through the motel. It's just crazy. I hate my SO and that that dude, you have to hate yours too. I know!
<laughs> they're like we have these arguments and we have separate okay this is like you can do your own thing but like like no judgment okay we have separate bank accounts we we like when we have enjoy things we go on separate vacations and um but i'm judging you because you met online and you spend too much time together i'm like okay they're like that's a bad relationship <laughs> It just makes me cringe. But at the same time, I'm like, yo, imagine meeting someone when you're 18 and then you get chronically ill and they still stay with you even when you're not like able to do most things and you look different and stuff. <laughs> like, and you're you're young. That's like something that ha like you find someone like that when you're in your 30s, not like young. Whoa, hey, why'd you do that? Bruh, you don't know, do you want loot? Or you don't want loot? <laughs> but yeah, not sharing an account. It, yeah, no, like, also, like, I'm, like, I guess I'm not very jealous or whatever, but I also realized that, like, I, okay, so, like, uh, as a, as a content creator, like, I get a lot of, like, male attention, and I always feel, like, weird about it. Like, it's sometimes, so I'm always, like, very sherry. But also Nerva has like access to all my accounts, not because, <laughs> not because we're like, okay, read all my DMs. He's always like, oh my God, I accidentally opened one of your notifs. Like just let you know, um, because I was logged in. It's because he posts all my social media for me sometimes. <laughs> like, can you go, can you go like post some live on my Twitter? Thanks, <laughs> like, <laughs> you know? And so it's like, I don't know. I just like never have felt the need. Like, I don't feel like I'm sneaking around or hiding. Or anything. You startled me. I don't know, but it's like, I don't even, I've never snooped on his phone before, at least not intentionally. Sometimes your eyes wander, you see a little, a screen light up and you, you your eyes auto read and you're like, oops, <laughs> but I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm assuming, okay, we need to go to the garage, but I'm assuming we can just go fart around, right? the baldwin mansion have we already been in there that sounds fun it's interesting <laughs> but yeah right not sharing uh, yeah it's it's weird it's weird though it's weird red beard like people are like this is your money this is my money this is whatever like i just buy shit all the time like i'm like uh i've made like you've helped with all my stream stuff like let me buy all this stuff plus then we don't have to worry about fu fucking taxes and stuff like i just buy stuff i'm like oh you need this thing here let me upgrade your pc because you're like doing all this stuff for hey, our stream you know way. we already passed the motel oh uh, we th are you telling me we can't go exploring ma'am fine streamline me why is she taking us to the motel i just realized what that's where we're going at that What's wrong with you? Why are you taking me to a motel when there's monsters? This woman, I swear. But yeah, it's weird. You guys watching a scary movie for spooky scene? I don't know. What should we watch? I kind of want to rerun all of the like Bly Manor, like Hill House ones. Any good ones? Back off, lady. I'm a loot goblin. We should chill in Midnight Mass. What is Midnight Mass? What, is that a scary movie? I've never seen it. I do that too never snoop though yeah it's hard not to i feel like that's natural like accidentally like eavesdropping different things like you're kind of you can but yeah we need something we buy it end of the dish <laughs> but yeah exactly it's like also you like bought gas like a couple times then then the other person's like oh let me buy the gas or whoever's like financially doing better just happens to buy more stuff at the time it's like i don't know most of the time we just force each other to buy things we want yeah yeah Dude, uh, like, Terrifier 2. I don't even know what that, that is. I don't even know what Terrifier 1 is. Same guy who made- Oh! <gasps> oh, it is? Is it new? Aw, oh, shit. Is it new? <gasps> T! Cause I, I know the one of, uh, what's the one that's based off of all the Edgar Allan Poe shit? There's like, uh, like it references the Raven, but it, uh, the fall of the house of Usher, that one. Love, hate, jealousy. 
why are you telling me this woman i feel like she's trying to be very like sensual and sexy but they're like i don't know i'm too much of a prude for her nonsense See, it's really interesting is our conversation we've had today, chat, because, like, it just shows, like, the over, like, sexualization and lewdness of so many things or weird things about relationships and all sorts of random stuff. We're just over here, like, can we just, like, cuddle? If anyone needs anything and fixing the pikes at, uh, flip. One of seven. We're just over here far. You know what? If you can't, you know, uh, chat, y'all who have significant others, do you fart and poop around your significant other? Because I know someone who they were dating their significant other for at least a couple years and they were living together in an apartment and she refused to poop when he was home. I'm like, bruh. It, dude, I got IBS and I'm extra gassy and I'll have you know, they, like, if we're gonna spend, like, 24 hours together and I'm not gonna not be around you, one of us is gonna have to fart and, and just rip that, rip that band-aid right off, okay? I am not... I could really use a warning next time. I am not holding my farts for 24 hours and, and, oh, and trying to sneak them out there and then awkwardly you, you smell or hear one, okay? James? Is everything all right? I'm just letting you know right now... Hey, One of us is gonna have to fart and, and break like that seal, person. okay? Okay? Yeah. I then have. everyone can have a more enjoyable experience instead of awkwardly having Taco Bell because, you know, we did. Yeah. And then now yeah. all of us are holding our farts yeah. and having tummy aches, okay? Yeah, it's just true. ridiculous. I am. Um... <laughs> it's like one or two years. I haven't seen it! It came out before House of. I somehow missed that. Oh my god, I haven't seen it. What? Oh my god. Now I have to watch it. We call out toots and laugh our asses. Dude, farts will never not be funny to me. And if I'm ever around people who don't think farts are funny, there's something wrong with them. Like, literally, farts are the universal language of humor. Everybody in a room, like, I think, I'm pretty sure uh, XQC said, said this. That, like, if everybody is in a room, or was it Ninja? It was them in a conversation. Anyway, if everybody was in a room and nobody spoke the same language and somebody ripped ass, everybody knows what that means. <laughs> I, yeah, but I call it fixing the pie. Oh, I got you. She's going to have some issues later on. <laughs> She was had exploded at some point. Have you checked up on her? She's probably, we're not friends. In it. Well, you know, she's not with that boyfriend anymore. She's the kind of friend who like only talks to you when her life is a disaster and she's, uh, she's engaged. She just had a baby and, um, and has a house and a dog now. So yeah, haven't heard from her in a while. You know, still think about her, care about her. Told her congrats when she announced she was preggers. Cozy. This room. There's something wrong with it. I. I think we should leave. What? Oh, loosen up, James. It sure beats running around with those monsters out there. I'm not so sure. Ma, what's wrong with this room? What? Now, his comment is weird. What does he mean there's something wrong with this room? That is odd. It was the guy who shared the King King Ass Ripper video every media share stream. <laughs> oh my god. Just mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, dude, I dude, she would like text me and she's like, oh my god, I'm dying. I have to poop so bad. And I'm like are you good? What's wrong? And she's like, I'm like, just go take a shit. Are you home? And she's like, yeah, but like, my boyfriend's here. And I'm like, dude, just go take a poop. She's like, no, I've never pooped while he's been home before. And they've been living together almost a year. I was like, ain't no way. This is the first. Uh, there is no freaking way that you've lived together for a year and you've never taken a shit. What do you do on weekends when you got well, you, you got days off? 
Does she? Uh, oh my good sir. Dude, it does, the brand new toilet doesn't even flush. How dare they? Yeah! At least six months, nine months. Didn't poop. I'm like, what happens on the weekends? Do you just like every day? Like, do you just not poop for like three or four days straight? You run to like... You, you prefer to poop in like a gas station bathroom or something instead of at home? Dude. Farting on my roommate's door, haha. Ha. That's Nerva. That's that was the first fart I ever heard of Nerva. He thought he muted, but he just muted me, not himself. What? Uh, one, one less. Three, one more. So zero, four, five, one. Zero, four, five, one. Zero, four, five, one. We were on a phone call and he farted on his brother's door and then I started laughing and then That was fine. And then also I made him I made him fart in front of me when he came to visit for the first time. I gave him a wet willy until he promised that he would be the first to fart hey, because I said I somebody I has to do it one. and you're the man. Uh, it's not going to be me. <laughs> That's the best way to fart. <laughs> what did I say it was? Zero? I have to look at it again. I, I already forgot. That's based me zero. <laughs> and then, you know what's the worst about it though? You know what's the worst about it is like fine. He's like fine, but I don't have one. And so after ta the for this, so, oh, zero, five, four. There is zero one five four. Thank you. After tackling him uh, and, and making him promise he would be the first to fart, he finally gets one. He tells me, he's "Like, just wait. You ready?" And I'm like, "Okay." And it's like, Beep. and I'm like, oh, "That's not it." Okay, I actually have to look, dude. Ram, uh, I probably, I probably did it wrong. Anyway, and I'm like, "What?" And he's like, "Your turn." And I'm like, "You know damn well." You know damn well. You you know you know damn well that mine was not that tiny. Ah, oh, you dyslexic me, Ramrod. Zero four five one. Zero four five one. Zero four five one. Zero four five one. I'm like, Whoa! oh my god! Please, I'm just please. hitting her in the head. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. I should have just left it. I'm sorry. I'm really mean. I just really don't like her. She's annoying. She me. She means well. She means well, or does she? I don't know. I think you just saved my life back there. You're welcome. Stop so touching me and flirting with me now, okay? I know we're trauma bonded after that, but you can go share your trauma with somebody else. Again, hard pass don't want. We gotta check all the places. Okay, um, are we just doing the gate now? Is that really all I th that we need? Okay. But yeah, well, the main reason that that's mean is because I think that something that someone has said about all of us. Wait, wait, what? I know the fact more than one person has blocked me because they think I'm annoying. No, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's because she literally is. Yay. We said we're looking for our dead wife and she happens to look like him or her and she keeps touching us, hitting on us and being like, loosen up. And I, I'm, I just can't handle it, dude. If, if somebody would not, if, if my significant, like, if I was a widow, and someone was like, mm, mm, I would be so like viscerally disgusting by that. Ugh. Hi, Miss Nicola. Just down this way. So I'm not a fan. She's like, oh, line up. Let's go to the motel together. And I'm like, Ugh! get out of here. 
She does not take no for an answer. She's never been told no in her life with that butterfly boob tattoo. It ends up actually being our wife and she's just faking. Hi, Miss Dicto, I love you. Hope you're doing well. Nom, 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 nom. Mwah. No. She's actually never died, been here this whole time. We just like ignored her. She almost died. She's like the artist, the, the artist bots on to Oh my god, Twitter. I had one recently, little cheeky bastard, reach out to me and be and and say that I already commissioned from them. And they've been waiting all this time and like I'm ignoring them and to pay them already for the stuff that I promised to commission from them. So, like g gaslighting, like it, it, I'm like, bro. Years. That's a long time. What will you tell her if, when you find her? That I love her. Oh. Then lucky her. What's that supposed to mean? Yeah, why is she so snarky? Like I said, three years is a long time. They, what? He doesn't love his wife after he hasn't seen her in three years? And thought she was dead? What's wrong with you, woman? See it? Like, she's like, oh. Ugh. That's disappointing. I was hoping that you'd say, oh, well, I've moved on. Fuck you, bitch. Like, what? See her toot, man. Not a fan of her too, chat. Oh, I think I just doubled back on myself. They must both of those places look in. Dude, I, what's wrong with her? <laughs> oh, yes. Almost indubitably. Found my way. Fuck you, bitch. I found someone better. She has a boob tattoo, unlike you. I, I don't know. Anyway, Mystic, how have you been? How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Sending you love. I think I just like doubled back again. Wait. I'm stupid, I think. Okay, there's an ad going, but um, I'm just gonna keep waddling around because you guys are missing nothing as I proceed to look at the same building like five times because I, the, I'm double, I'm confused. About the layout. Some with butt. Same with butt tattoo. Ugh. Dude, I, at this time of night, at midnight, almost every day, my AMD is like trying to upgrade open command prompt. And I'm like, bro, can you. Dude, the. F something. <laughs> There's a. There's an actual running car going on over there. And really creepy looking shutters. That's nice. Nice touch. What? I don't think this was the direction Strange. I was supposed to go. This should not be here. Well, it is. So, what now? Now we look for another way. <sighs> that trigger monsters now, that would be great. I still want to go back to the mansion. No. James. Oh, dear Lord. She had lips tattooed on her butt cheeks? Yo, that's a TMI, Beppo. during the cutscene. That's my bad, chat.
Yo, he's zoinked out. Game's going good, except for it's really scary, and I'm a weenie. I'm a weenie. Don't break my heart. My achy, breaky heart. I just don't think you understand. You could tell my heart. My achy, breaky heart. Oh. Gonna have to kill another crawling thing. Oh man, they're every freaking where. Crawling and scuttering all around. Where am I supposed to go? I don't even know. Time to go and smack them all around. Bam! 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 I feel like we went past the, a point of no return and I'm sad because I wasn't done exploring. I didn't mean to get hit into that. I meant to hit the one on the ground, but... Ah, it starts. I dodged! Too late, apparently. It's fine. Everything's fine. Dude, I just genuinely wanted to explore. I'm gonna be honest. I wanted to go to the manor. Uh, can we go back or am I like hard set locked into this like area now? I'm like so sad. <laughs> but I'm waiting because I kind of want to use a syringe. So I want to be as like dead as I'm going to be. Oh shit! I am officially as dead as I'm going to be. Trolling. Man. Can I not go back now? I wanted to go to the Balder Mansion. Cha! I accidentally progressed the game without fully exploring. I got the key and I thought there was places to go and I was just doing extra exploring and now I'm sad that I didn't do because I didn't know which was the place of progression and now I can't go back. Uh, that seems like progression because we're slow walking. Game is long enough. Fair enough. I'm assuming you can't go back though. Bruh. Lame. I wanted to go to the mansion. Missed stuff. Eee! Holding your hands up, scared of the spider in the shower. That was me when I had a spider on me. Butterfly? Oh. <laughs> Keep door flies. Nerva just flakes spiders. I'm the one who kills the spiders, and it's no fair. I'll have you know. Hi, 
No, I'm good. I got a tummy ache. It's because I ate steak, unfortunately. Makes me feel like I'm gonna poop my pants. Oh! Red Solo Cup! I fill you up! Let's have a party! Aw, hi, buddy! Glint sticks. No, I struggle eating um, meat. Um, and getting enough protein. So I uh, usually, if it's like ground or minced and stuff, it helps a lot. But we just had like steak steak. For whatever reason, the, the redder the meat, like pork's the worst, beef's under that. And then like, um, whatever. But yeah. It's kind of hit and miss. Like, you, if it's if it's been ground and stuff, that can be better. But me and meat aren't the biggest f friends, even though um, ready to kill it. Even though it's good, I need to eat more protein. I'm supposed to be upping my protein content. I mean, it was it was seasoned and stuff, but it's just any sort of meat that is um, just like having a steak is just really hard. Chicken's a lot easier. Fish is fine, but my parent, my family is really big on like just eating steak as like a several, like it's a treat for most people. But like we eat steak all the time, and we had uh, beef steak. Hello? As a treat today, and I wanted to eat some because I wanted to eat, um, but, and I didn't even eat that much. But yeah, it always sits, it's super heavy in the bottom of my gut. Just not very good at digesting meat in general. Behind door number three! Oh, is this a strip club? <laughs> oh. I don't know, it's some sort of bar. Is this the Aria? place that she wanted us to go because it's where couples go? Like, oh my god. Stop. <laughs> what? Oh, come on, don't give me that look. I was just kidding. What is this? Ah, uh, she definitely this <laughs> me where I'm working. Now? Don't be silly. Just have to go through and out the front. I guess that's why then she again, had the keys. Now that we're here, can't we stay? Just for a little He's while. He's looking for his wife and thinking she possibly isn't we dead. Back out there. I don't have time to take a break. Mary could be out there, waiting for me. I you know. wouldn't leave little old me alone by it's my lonesome. I am some place, This whole thing, it's like a nightmare. I just wanted to get away from it, even for a second. I'm sorry. I... No, it's, it's fine. She uh, fake crying. Sorry, I, I didn't mean that. God. I guess this place is getting to me too. It is sad though, I get it. If it's it is scary out there. I don't like it either. I'm trying to get through it as quick as possible, ma'am. Am I crazy? 
you know, for thinking she could be here. Crazy is one word for it, I guess. I can think of another. What's that? Hopeful. Aw, at least she's okay, and she's. Oh. That's a nicer way of putting it. Here. Yeah, everybody needs a drink. I do too, after playing this game. <laughs> what are you doing? Something to take the edge off. Yeah, she does seem like his wife's evil twin. She's like from the other, uh, the upside down version of her. No? You sure? Dude, I would have a fucking drink if the, in this situation. Fine. Be that way. Here's to... To hope I'm dying. Oh, okay, that's kind of cute. Okay, okay, she's growing on me when she's not doing her little flirt thing. She's obviously used to it working for her, but it's not working on me, woman. We should probably get going. Oh, he's not gonna drink it? Fine. Somebody pluck his, his eyebrow. There's a couple stray hairs right there. Ready when you are. She just been evil all along. I don't know. Maybe this place made her weird. We both lost our memory. The aesthetic though of this like part, this bar right here is cool. I like it. Ignore the, I ignore the, the, the pulse. Okay. Oh my God. It's a yellow cat. I love the neon though. Fifth river. Right, so look up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lost and found. Oh, there's a wedding ring. And a photo. Is that our wallet? You see what I'm saying? Like a wallet with like a, in a wedding ring. He looks like he needs it. I don't need it. I've been sober for 23 years. I ain't starting now. Me, when I run out of fireball. Oh. Then me, when I decide to get more fireball. Oh, there's a save station. I like the the funky jams though. Bing, 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 bing. All that shit is ours now. Yeah, we should have looted it. Get the cool shades. All the all the jam, dude. This place is dirty. Y'all not clean this place like ever. By. Is it? It'd be like, dude. It feels like human trafficking, though. If all the 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 girls here have like the tattoos, though. Emotional you know what I mean? Damage. It's kind of sus. Why do they all have the tattoos? Like, what do they? Is the do you have to work you here? Let's go. All right then. Come on. I mean, it feels like the path of no return, but I don't think we can return here, so. Ugh, the lighting is crazy in here, though. We could come back later if you want. You know, it's gonna be okay. Okay. I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Whatever you say. Me chucking my heels. Please tell me we're back in the front. Oh God, we've traveled so far. I never got to go to the Baldwin Mansion! No! Disappointment. Hiya! 
again. <laughs> I break the windows if I want to break them. Ain't nobody here to stop me. Oh, it's a it's an arcade machine. All right. Oh, yeah, oh. Man, for once my looting got me in trouble. I was like, man, we're extra exploring. I feel like you have to touch stuff to like update your map. So I was like, oh, we'll go look in. Man. Yeah, we probably just can't go. Okay, that unlocks though. Uh, I wasn't done exploring. I was like perimetering the place. Because we had like a key and like stuff. I feel like I missed stuff. My OCD is not happy about it. I think that's the right direction, so I'm gonna double back. How's everybody doing though? Thank y'all for hanging out. Um, probably at least just get like to the next location that we're going and the stuff, and then um, pause for the night. Considering we got through uh, through chapter ish three, I don't know. I don't know what to call them. I'm gonna assume that's chapter three. Looking for the heels. One of these days. I think I'm actually getting used to you smashing stuff up. <laughs> oh, is this the way out? It might be. I'm trying to get used to also the th that like and just kind of zone out and not get too bothered by the um the third person oh okay that is that has to be the way out then unless there's another side oh oh my god more of those things must have missed that first shot okay so is it hiding something dude i came all the dude I came all the- okay. Bolates! Okay, I'll take some ammo. Even though I used four shots and only gained three. <sighs> whatever. Whatever, 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 whatever. Okay, well, I guess that is the path of progression. Sorry. My OCD compels. <laughs> I'm assuming we can't go back, which is a bit unfortunate. I'm a little sad. Unless we can go up Nathan Avenue way up there through a side route. I missed the collectibles! Oh yeah, this is the big crevasse. Look. We're on the other side of that chasm. Yeah, but I didn't want to yet. Hey, at least we're here. I didn't yeah, want to out. yet, woman. Come on, we'll find out. I do like her hair. It's my kind of style. <laughs> oh, can we go back to the garden? <gasps> I bet it doesn't double through though. No, don't progress. No progress. Are you telling me I can't go back through? Once I open it? No! I did it again, Chad. I did it again. I progressed without exploring again. Biscuits! I wasn't done! I didn't check the other side of the street. Well. That's it? A garden? There's a bit more to it than Okay, that. that's cute if that's the yeah, thing. If you say so. There's nothing anyway. Okay, thank you. I don't think I've been here before. Come on. She's just around the corner. Keep keep telling she? keep telling me that so that my OCD leaves me alone. I feel as though I've missed everything. Cuz we missed so much in the first area by not exploring. 
Is she? There's a story told around these parts. Kind of a local legend. It tells of a woman who was cast out. Sentenced to die on an island out on the lake. Mm. But there was a man in town who fell madly in love with her. <laughs> and every night, he would sneak out row across the lake, bringing her food and uh, company. Yeah. And every night, she would stand there on the shore, holding a lit candle to help him find his way. <laughs> but this one night, a terrible Can't storm come. broke out, caught him out in the open, and it blew out the candle. Even in darkness, the man would not give up. He would not turn back. So he fought against the raging waters until finally the lake took him. They say even then, the woman never lost hope. She kept coming out at night, kept lighting the candle to bring her beloved home, to lead him to shore. Not sure how much truth there is to it. It's probably just a fairy tale. But she's become something of a local saint. A patron of undying love. Hence this place. She's not here. What? She's not here. And why would she be? I don't even remember this place. No! We missed so much shit, guys! This was a mistake. We there was two this it changed the ending of the game. The us going to the inn in the very beginning instead of walking hey. down that fucking street. It's okay. Oh my god. We have other places to look. We can still I knew it. We missed a whole section Come of the on. game by going to the inn and not going down the street and checking more. We could have went to Pete's Bullarama and like other locations and had more lore and story. And it changes the ending of the game. And then you would loop back and then go back to the thing. So we like speed ram the wrong way. Okay. Man! <gasps> so there was a whole entire, like, side encounter if you didn't go the place it told you to with her. And you went to several of the locations in the game with, like, lore and all sorts of stuff. And I guess that it gives you a better relationship with her and, like, changes the ending of the fucking game. <laughs> <gasps> no! I was trying to explore more instead of like trigger the freaking cutscene. That's so annoying. I'm so sad. No toilet for us, I suppose. Oh, I thought the shine meant we could interact with it. Well, we don't get to go to the Bullarama and the pizza place chat. How disappointing. I think it came from inside the theater. 
Are you coughing because you're laying upside down? Do your guys' dogs do this? They lay upside down, they cough, and then they refuse to upright themselves because they they are determined to to be on their back. Um. Ah. Man, I'm sad. My my FOMO. My FOMO has has dude. We missed the Baldwin Mansion. We missed the Bolarama. And the uh, dude, we probably missed that diner. Yeah, the Bolarama, Silent Hill historical, like all the stuff up here we missed. Damn. I'm sad. You okay? Yeah. Maybe you better wait here. Dude, the, okay. that's true. There's Not more. It said. Then, anyway. It said there was a ton of enemies if you went that way. And James? Yeah. My ooh. Be careful in there. Yeah. I mean, we could reload, but that would only be if you guys wanted. Shall we continue or should we reload? Ch Boring. Chat, you still get do all of this stuff? I don't really want to go through multiple times. <laughs> Do you think something is off with her face? I mean, it, 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 it does make an uncanny joke. One in the chat if we continue, two in the chat if we reload. I feel like we could speed run the other bits. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out! I don't mind either. Do you do what you want to do? I feel like we missed like fun exploration. Although I'm looking at this and I'm I don't We've definitely overrid some saves by accident. Do we do it? It's only 30 minutes ago. Fuck it! Stay close. Oh no! It overrid our save at the inn. We ha damn no, we can't. We can't chat. I I I when I it, I because like remember we saved in front of the inn. It's not here. That's probably what they do that on purpose, the little bitches. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely not going back to the three hour one and doing the apartments all over again for that. Oh well. Chat, no FOMO for you. I'm sorry. A garden? Okay, let's speed There's run this. More to it than that. If you say so. Hey, we weren't far. Okay, I don't let's think go. I've been here before. Come on. She's just around the corner. Sorry, chat. She? Man, I guess I should be saving like on more like different save locations more. Oh well. Bubble checking. There's no loots. No loots. No loots. No boots. I think it came from inside the field. No loots and boots and boots and loots. <laughs> well, we're screwed now. You okay? He, and he cut himself. All right. Well, it was easy enough to try. It's Eddie and the child. <laughs> you should have seen your face. I told you, it was this big rat. Jumped right at me from under the seat. You would have screamed too if you saw it. Guts, fatso. Hey, 
That's mean. That child's a brat. I think we startled them. I think we startled them. Cut his life into pieces. I missed a chunk of the game. Disappointing. My FOMO. Can't handle the bad decision. Should have been following a playthrough. To the toilets! Does it flush? Does it? I, I love that I pretend like anything is gonna change. When we know that it's just disappoint, no replay. <laughs> Disappointed new replay. Dude, I thought I was saving plenty. Also, what's the point of coming in the pooper if there's not gonna be anything in here? Come on. Oh, something there though. Eh, I'll take it. Maybe in like different, like, maybe it's like a little RNG or in the hard mode, there's more collectibles because it's hard, you know? It's very possible. Whoop. Oh, well, it is what it is. Okay. Um, next. Huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> next save location, I might call it, but um, I was enjoying exploring. I like the outside the most. I think I also just aesthetically like going around the town and stuff. I love like world building environments that like you get to like look around and really like feel like it's like lived in and stuff. I, I this is one of my favorite things. Like I really enjoyed that about, um, Oh, wait, you, you want a cupcake, Mr. Wu? You already had one today and you smushed it on my carpet. <laughs> um, I, I really love like the world building like environments where like, um, it feels like lived in and, and something, you know, where's the child now? Why is only he there? And I, I really felt that with like Alan Wake and stuff. Eddie? Oh. Uh, what is on his hand? Uh, James. We met back at the apartment building. Yeah. Is it cold in I here? I remember. Or he's just eating ice cream with his hand. Bruh. I see that you didn't make it out yet. Mm, yeah. I just didn't get around to it yet. Well, at least you got your appetite back. There's a secret dog ending! Are you alone here, Eddie? Chat, we missed the secret dog ending. Um, no. Oh my god. Well, that's probably just Laura messing around. The little girl? Laura, is that her name? That's what she I'm said. I'm gonna have to deep dive this after a stream. I'm gonna go look for her. You coming? Now you want me to come with you? Never mind. What? Why is he so mean? We asked him if he wanted to come with us before, didn't we? And he said no. Why are you such a weirdo? Who is that girl anyway? I don't know. All I know is her name. I swear. All right. Do you have a more dialogue? Uh, didn't you want to go after her? Better hurry. Laura can be pretty quick when she wants to. <laughs> Suit yourself. Weird. You're just not gonna watch a movie now? Okay. What a weirdo. 
Laura! Do they just lead to the next theater? I never thought of that. Probably do, don't they? Oh. Laura! Man, okay, hold on. I need more cupcake action. Chat, I'm so upset that there is a different, there's a, a dog ending. I know we didn't get it. And I'm insulted by this. You. Are you going to bed? Oh, okay. <laughs> she has just become quite the talker. I love you, Zora. May sweet girl. Oh, look at these old, these old film projectors. They're so cool. Nah, the dog thing is hardened until dawn. I don't know about a uh, dog ending in this. I only know about the until dawn dog ending. Look at all the films. Whoa, what a collection. Dude, in real life, that would be worth a fortune nowadays. You know? And they're huge reels. Crazy. Cool to look hey. at, though. Girl, come back! I'm looking for loot. Me supposed to be in a hurry. Me also being like, bro, I keep dying. I'm looting, I'm looting. <sighs> James, why you gotta grunt so loud like that, huh, buddy? But yeah, that's in Until Dawn, the dog, the secret dog thing you get an achievement for it if you could if you keep it alive though and you succeed it's called like man's best friend or something wait are we back at the oh we did loop what the fuck okay Laura stop it's dangerous girl Girly pop! Maria? Oh. Did you see the little girl? Yeah, I tried to stop her, but she went that way. We can still catch her. <laughs> what happens if I go the wrong direction now? Aww. I tried, chat. Man. I don't like that where this is heading, chat. Not one bit. I have an idea of where I think we're going. That theater is cool. Um, let's just peek around a little bit. Oh, <gasps> the dog ending is an NG plus. Oh, my FOMO, thank you. I love that karate is just over here. Helping the, helping a homie out to not have terrible like OCD tendencies. <laughs> Mm 
Where'd he went? Yeah, we already checked that way. Okay. All that's left is near the hospital. That sounds so fun. <laughs> There's so many. How many James, are there? Look. Oh, dear God. Jump scare cutscene. Mm. My favorite. My favorite kind of cutscene. The jump scare kind. Mmm. Tasty. Time to go in the hospital. Mmm. 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 Oh, it's so loud. Let me turn it down. Sorry, guys. I genuinely just don't see in those windows very well unless I break them. Ah, man, anxiety. Is this the one that opens? Yeah, so I guess we can at least backtrack there, but that's not that hopeful. That's not where I missed! Dude, just, you, just you keeping him healed keeps you at one ending? What do you mean? Like, you don't end the game at zero health or something? So much stuff changes the ending? Eight? Good lord! Is that including NG+. Plus? Some are exclusive. Oh, okay. And some are new to the remake? Bruh! What gives? Hey, come on. We gotta catch up to her. Fine. Yeah, I know. It's just, uh... She seems just fine. I think we're yeah. doing uh, less well than she is, if I'm, if I'm being honest. Tell me they're... Dude, how is there not heels in the thing? Is there, if there is there a zero deaths run? Because if that's a thing, dear lord. I know people are gonna play it that much though. That's fun though. Games that have replayability or choice. Keep James as low health where possible. Oh my gosh, really? Ugh. That would drive me nuts with the red aura and stuff. Wait, shotgun ammo? Oh, great. Is that a gun cabinet? In a hospital? Yeah. Safe it's empty. Shotgun safety Somehow rules. That seems worse. Keep your weapon pointed in a safe direction. Finger off the trigger until you're ready to shoot. And keep your gun unloaded. Till you need it. Eh, basic firearm safety. Every good old hunting and fishing youngin of the wilderness knows these things. Look beyond what you see. Why is this? Okay, let the low key pretty, but also ugh, ugh, disturbing. Where did she go? I don't know. Let's look around. Remember, if you experience. And it's poor appetite or significant weight loss, insomnia or hypersomnia, loss of interest or pleasure in unusual, in usual activities, feeling of worthlessness, diminished ability to think or concentrate, con con concentrate, <laughs> <laughs> contact your, your healthcare provider immediately. That is not the right thing, American Second Amendment. Y'all don't know typical firearm safety, you telling me? Nobody, nobody clips what I said, okay? You, you heard and you saw nothing. Um. Brookhaven Hospital, 1920, damn. Damn. God. These signs are so creepy. Pool, pharmacy, dog. Dude, the hospital has a pool? That's sick! These like new endings or NG Plus along with the previous ones. Mm. 
Interesting. That's cute, though. I like that. More poopers! You know what I will say about this game is a W with the poopers is, um... They haven't used the same asset for every single toilet. I mean, besides the break, obviously. There's actually been a variation in environment with the toilet kinds of flushers and everything. It's not just like a recolored, retextured um, toilet. They've actually added variation to the poopers. I just felt like, in case you were wondering, oh, that's a nice. Hughes and Dr. Arkinson in the garden. Um, cafeteria, doctor's lounge reception. Nurses in training. Did you know back in the day that nurses were supposed to be unmarried? There was like a thing. They didn't want you to be married. There was like a whole bunch of like weird niche rules where like, um, and yeah, they always wore the, the those uniforms and stuff. Very good jump scare chat. Good on them. Oh, uh, look at the floppy disk! This is like the first kind of computer. I had one like this. Only it had, it didn't sit on a box, it had a tower. When I was a little, little muncher. Mmm, save station! Actually, let me wait and finish looting this area before I do that. It looks like there is a key in there. Oh. We should look around. It might be written down somewhere. I love that. So I'm trying to get a like a lay of the land. Okay, that that genuinely was it, I think. Oh yeah, we didn't go through this door yet. Oh, this is where we started, right? Or no, no. I'm stupid. We haven't been here. Okay. Before I say, we'll finish looting. Due to repeated incidents of key getting misplaced from the point forward, they are to be returned to the locker at the end of every shift. That's just smart for us, like, doctors, please. All staff are required to memorize the paid lock combination, not to disclose it to anyone but authorized personnel under any circumstances. Case of any problems, report to the head nurse in examination room three. Okay, so examination room three is where the lock is, and or the whatever. The combination, excuse me. Oxygen must be turned off when not in use. Oh, T, okay. Director requested the files of the three crucial patients. You know which ones. Could you please bring them to the office? Okay. And. Oh, that's really interesting. If you shine the light at her in her face, she like if you you're close. To find me, James? Oh shit, she got dialogue to it too. Ah, nice niche. Niche, ah. Alright. And now we are in chapter four. Um I'm gonna manually override one of these bottom ones. Ta -da! I think that's a good stopping point. It's almost 1 a.m. For me. And I know that we only got so far, but I would prefer to start tomorrow on a, on a bit of a passive part of the game than, than in the middle of the shit storm. <laughs> <sighs> okay, seems like okay, which leaves three regular endings. Oh, I see, I see. Interesting. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and everything. I I really appreciate y'all. Sorry I had so much just chatting today like during when we should have been playing, but I had so much fun. I'm definitely enjoying the game more now that I don't suck as bad at it. <laughs> Um, a little bit. Uh, I still definitely suck, uh, the big turd at it, but it's been, it's been lots of, uh, lots of fun and everything. But um, it's been, it's been and, and, and hanging out with y'all and stuff. So thank you guys so much. Shout out to Karate for helping us get through because I'm definitely struggling with, um, the difficulty. <laughs> It's hard. It's difficult. It's the it's the the spoopies a hundred percent. 
So, um, yeah, thank you. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and everything. And, you know, we're trying to get through it. We're trying to get through it. Um, who should we raid? Well, I mean, the, you're right. The walkthrough is dumb because the pyramid head fight, like, you, you just had to wait. But it said to shoot them, and I can 100% without cert, like, uncertain, like, I am 100% certain. Uh, I'm gonna send you guys over to, uh, to Kaisa. She's really cute! She, fun fact about Kaisa, she has two different colored eyes. She has heterochromia, which is really cool. Um, she's currently playing, um, Silent Hill, and she just started her stream, or restarted it, I'm not entirely sure. Um, and uh, she streams really late, which is really cool. So um, go check her out. Thank you so much to Auburn and Taurus for the for the raids today. I'll be back tomorrow for um, more games, more continuing. We gotta keep blowing through, busting down the doors of this game. Uh, where we're never gonna finish it, considering my OCD tendencies. If you guys could go take some time to go say hi to my friend. Drop a follow. Check her out. She's really cute. I met her uh, in person at TwitchCon before. She's super, super sweet and all. Please go check her out. And then uh, if you guys want to keep up to date with all the stuff, Discord is the best way. And my most uh, other active platforms are Twitter, um, YouTube, and uh, the Discord, of course. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to try to get these things edited out. They might take me a little bit, but I'm trying. Thank you for your patience with my migraine day and being a little late to stream but i'll see you guys tomorrow 7 p.m mount standard time which is 6 p.m pacific or 9 p.m eastern and please go give some love and i'll see you guys tomorrow for the haunted hospital how fun <laughs>